good Wednesday. Wednesday morning, everybody. Forgot what day of the week it was for a hot second there. My name is Cameron, and I'm playing Genshin Impact this morning. Again. It's a fun game. I need no excuse. Not a very bright day out today. It's very foggy. So I had to make my own light. So I turned my light on over there, and lo and behold, whacked my funny bone right into the wall. Actually got a little bump there. It's unfortunate. I'm always rather accident prone. I'm always bumping into things. That or burning myself like on hot tea in the morning as I did previously to hitting my funny bone. And it's still kind of numb. But that's what you get when you rush around in the morning. You just gotta take a chill. Take a chill pill. Slow down a bit. Slowing down is always good. I had a wonderful night's rest. I was very, very relaxed after doing my drawing session last night. It was rather pleasant. Anyway, time to continue with the Windbloom Festival. Story stuff, I guess. Oh, really? Bunch of love. I don't know what's going on here. Venti's like gonna give romantic advice to all these young potential suitors. You must have heard of her. Barbara. Oh, I know Barbara. I have Barbara. Not to mention I've Jesse. got you the Barbara. And she always lifts the people of Mondstadt's spirits with her smile and songs. I'm such a big fan. <laughs> well, this guy's voice. Like it's so... It's well. so a little raspy. This guy's I voice is like, I love Barbara. Oh, Barbara's so guys. nice. I'm the head of the Barbara's Barbara my arm. <laughs> the head of the yeah. Barbara fan club. I'm pretty pleased about it too, by the sound of things. I carry the hopes and expectations of every member of the fan club on my shoulders. At this special time of year, I pledge to send our blessings to Barbara Sama herself. Oh my goodness. Course, as a level-headed adult, I would never want to call <laughs> Venti in the distance like I'm just waiting for my this guy with the bard so I can explain the plan. <laughs> All the flowers picked by our members and turn them into a huge giant flower statue. Then to give her That's a huge that's cool and all. And you know what? That's the reason she keeps it's because of fans like you that they continue to perform like that. You know, that's a wonderful, wonderful thing. This giant statue will be about two stories high. Sounds like it might just cause her some disturbance. Yes, it's all in good faith, but like, what if she doesn't want it? Have you asked her if she wants the flowers? Like, oh, I love the flower, thanks so much. You know what, go for it, buddy. Just go do your thing, you know what? If you're into it, be into it. If you're passionate about it, I'm sure it'll be wonderful. Just maybe don't be surprised if she's not totally into it. I gotta go. Gotta go. Gotta go build this two-story high flower. Or Barbara-sama. Well, alright. That was... Unfortunate. What about the next one? Oh, I, I did talk to all the ones. All of them. Let's go talk to you. I see what's going on here. What's up, Marvin? What's your story, Marvin? You love sick as well for a Miss Barbara? Paimon heard that you were seeking help from the bard over there. Where is assistance? Why not talk to us? Yeah, talk to us, we're good. We like, we know the bard very well. And in some cases are actually the bard. Uh, don't be shy. It doesn't matter who you talk to. At the end of the day, you still gotta talk to your prospective sweetheart. You just gotta go out and get him. Just say anything, really. Go to your sweetheart and be like, hey. I just wanted to be friends. Well, maybe don't do that. Maybe that'll lock yourself in the friend zone. <laughs> hey, how you doing? Venti, are you trying to be sneaky? Is she from the city? No, she lives in Springvale, quite away from me. And what the heck is Springvale? Let's just say that our families are quite different. My father objects to us being together. Oh, it's a sad love story. <laughs> One family says, no, you cannot court the other. And then the other family's like, yeah, what they said. And now, you can't date. 
<laughs> I must remedy the relationship I have with my father so that I can properly court my Marla. Formal approval is a nice gesture, Isabel. I'm gonna say, Daddy, I don't care what you think. I'm gonna, I'm gonna date Marla, and 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 here's this flower to make up for it. Thanks, Daddy. Does it sound childish? I mean, like, if you got nothing else to give your father but a flower, then that's that's that. Take some more time to consider. <laughs> Bad idea. Nah, do it. Bring it all the way up to 11. Full force. Full send. Do it. Tell your father. <laughs> Tell your father. I see. Understood. Thank you. You're welcome. Another thing. Didn't you say you were going to give flowers to your father? Your father. Don't you want to give her something? Nah, she hates flowers. Ah, now that you mention it. I wanted the bard to teach me how to compose a love poem. <laughs> Better not neglect her. Of course. And I'll give her some flowers, too. Yeah, I'll pick some later. Thank you for your help. You know, you're, you're not too... cringy. You're not too bad. You seem to have, like, an actual situation on your hands of something that's a little compromising for your relationship, and you're doing something about it. That's wonderful. Maybe not doing something about it to the point where you're going to build a... Hey! two-story high flower, but doing something about it in your own special way. That's a little more along with what I would do. It's the honorary knight in Paimon. Yes, indeed. I'm sure you've heard of us. The honorary Favonian knights who are still waiting on their complimentary wine. Master Jean. Diligent woman. Talented and always gets the job done. Honest, kind, gentle, not to mention. All right, get it. She's pretty great. All right, you like Jean. Sorry. That's good. Once I get talking about Master Jean, I get a bit excited. Do you like Master Jean? I'll finish composing my poem, pick a fresh dandelion bouquet, head over to the office, and hand the flowers to the guard. Cute. It's just the bouquet and the poem. I don't know. Are you into the hmm. in, Are you into the Jean or are you into That's the guard? Either way, it's cool. I want to be her no secret admirer. Nature. I'm afraid she'll send a gift in return if she sees my name. She's so busy, I wouldn't want Oh, so you're gonna be a little sneaky about it? If I can get this a little secret love desk, poem? That's cute. But then, I remember the cuteness of secret love poems back in, like, middle school. Oh, what should I do? But it was always, uh, like, you know, I want to know who's sending me these letters so that I could potentially, you know, take the next step and, uh, talk to them, but there's no name on them. Secret admirers? Nah. The kind of woman who'd come looking for you if she saw your name. If you really want to spare her the I was always the kind of guy to put my name on things. Right. Nothing of mine goes Why out without my name on it. It's not without its risks, but her extreme conscientiousness is what I like Because, like, her. what if somebody's like, so yo, me, this is the best damn essay I've ever seen. I can't wait to give it an A+. Plus. That's taken care of, then. They must know who I'll to give the A+, plus to. I'll or, God, this essay yeah, sucks and the love yeah. poem is raunchy. Will do. Who do I smack upside the head? Who's responsible for this? Time to talk to Venti. Well, Venti, how do you feel about the crowd today? Well, let's see there, Xiangling. The crowds are pretty, uh, pretty okay. No one's as hopeless as this boy over here who claims to be a wolf. He's pretty out there. Seems like my gestures weren't always translated into the advice I intended to give. Oh, you already gave them advice. My communication for next time. Uh, or maybe you should use like your godly powers to be like, go, fall in love, hmm. be happy. What are you three up to? Mind if I get in on the action? Oh, buddy. Kaya. <laughs> are you also here for romantic guidance? Kaya. <laughs> it's the greatest bard in town, and now the greatest romantic advisor in town, no doubt. I've heard that Still, Kaya's got a thing for Albedo. To to. Oh, you mean teaching people Hot. to compose love poems? Exactly that. I heard you were teaching classes. <laughs> I want to learn how to make so sweet poems, right too. I must know. Kaya, you want to learn how to compose love poems, too? 
I'm not yeah, so right? Shabby. You thought Mr. Mysterious over here wouldn't need any help making a love poem? Well, you are actually completely incorrect. <laughs> I can't even read a dictionary. Maybe I, I would think Kai is the kind of guy who's like, yeah, I'm all cool on the inside. But I actually can't read. Which means I also can't write. Nah, he's probably an avid reader. Maybe he just can't write. That or when it comes to actually taking the words from his own brain and putting them onto paper, he just can't seem to let it happen. Poetry's always nice to do. I've done a bit of poetry in the past. Usually the only poetry I've done in recent years is, you know, like love poems for the dearest. Or for like cards and stuff. Like when I make a card, it's, it's got to have a poem on it somewhere. Because like, it's cute and, uh, you know, lasts longer than flowers do. And Anna's always appreciated it, so I've always continued. Precisely. All in exchange for payment. What are we talking about? Homework? These are my demands. <laughs> I have demands. I demand you tell me about love poem writing. Is that so bad? I just think that with that was a very interesting laughing animation. See them all the way through. More fun for everyone involved, don't you think? I laugh at you. What do you say? Feel like Kaya's knack for mischief is like keeling over in absolute hilarity. Correcting homework. This is indeed a vital step. Is that, a, is that a vital step in the process? Must I correct homework first before I can be a great poem lover? As in, as in a lover, but as it pertains to poetry? Or perhaps I should have just called it a, a poet. These demands go both ways, dear Kaya. Coercion contact. Showdown between pros? Well, well I don't know. Pay special attention to your homework and guarantee that you will see improvement in your studies. But as for oh, he's the one that's studying. Kai, I completely missed a good portion of the conversation. I don't even know what I was talking about, really. But, alas. One bottle of the good wine. Yeah, that dandelion wine that everyone's been talking about that you should have probably very good access to. I mean, you are the brother of the, 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 the you know, Rome. Or at least the owner. Like, come on. Still waiting on that Favonian wine. That's a good saying. I don't like that. That was, that was an uncomfortable close-up of Venti's face. <laughs> and the music definitely suits it. That was weird. <laughs> it's the names of all my past lovers. Oh no, it's all the people that you have to help. Bennett, trial by fire. Young Bennett is one of the most passionate adventurers in Mondstadt. He is also by far the least fortunate, so infamous, infamous in his bad luck that other adventurers are rarely willing to team up with him. Yet Bennett has grown used to being alone and doesn't let it discourage him. No matter how many injuries he may suffer, his fiery passion for adventure burns on. Come on, there's treasure waiting up ahead in the unknown. Benny's adventure team, assemble. Oh, Benny. Wow. Oh, Benny. Bennett's really fired up for this. Maybe because that's his, his vision Excellent. thing. What do they call it? Like vision, I think, Make on their sure hip. Vigor into your poetry. Yes, sir. Yes, Even I can do that. Want to learn how to write poetry. I see this is going to be a popular class. Come adventure, Kaya or not? Kaya, oh, jeez. Kaya, are you not an adventurer yourself? I guess you're not. You're just a rich boy. You're a rich boy. And you're drinking my wine. I would like every one of you to compose a love poem and hand it to me for constructive, constructive criticism. criticism. As for your Make me a love poem, piece, and I'm gonna rip it to pieces. Wait until the course is over before paying. <laughs> don't even don't worry, but baby. what if it sucks? Don't worry about it. In addition to Mora, payment in alcohol is also warmly welcomed. Payment in alcohol. That's always a good barter. Sir, does our special a while ago, actually, I was helping a friend out. They, don't, they didn't have a car at the time, and so I was driving them to work a couple days a week. And I was like, instead of paying me in money, instead, excuse me, we're going to go to the liquor store, and I'm going to pick something out. You're going to pick something out. I'm going to buy my thing. 
and you're gonna buy your thing but you're gonna buy your thing for me and then we're gonna head back to my house hang out for a little bit and have a couple of cocktails and i built up my co it was a nice way to build up my collection that way and it was nice because you know like they spend some money on whatever the bottle was. I spent some money on my bottle, the bo bottle that I would purchase myself, and then we just have a good time. So it really all worked out. It's a nice, nice trade. In that case, when Kai has finished with his homework, let's go and look for. Good morning to you, Dakota. Welcome back once again. How are you? Apparently, we're making love poems. We're or rather not making love poems. We're teaching people to make love poems. Honestly, I want to see what kind of poetry advice I get from a video game. That's not necessarily been designed for poetry in mind let's see windbloom festival part one complete ode to flower and whatever the other word was part two missive of cloud and fog schoolwork nice what subject do you have your schoolwork on i'm on spring break right now i've got one more term left of my undergraduate slash accelerated graduate degree and so let's see what do i have next term my next class is, is just my senior design. Last term, I have a, a class on mythology in the movies, where we'll actually watch movies during class. I, I just took a look at the syllabus. We're watching Thor our first week. Awesome. Speaking of Marvel, which I was mentioning yesterday. Uh, and in addition to that, let's see. Um, what's the other class? And the other ones are like statistics and stuff. It's uh, statistics on genomics, probably. Uh, I've taken a class with this professor before. She's pretty chill. Math homework and American history. <laughs> but not posting anything. Hello. I've heard... Actually, no. Not even just heard about it. I've experienced the annoyance of professor being like... Or professor or teacher being like, Oh, um, I'll post something for you to do tomorrow. Like, I'll have homework for you to do tomorrow. And then, lo and behold, tomorrow comes. It's like... 12 o'clock in the afternoon, and you're like, um, teach, you haven't posted anything yet. Do, do I mention it? The answer is, is always no. Like, never mention, like, if, you, if your professor doesn't mention work, don't mention it. You, they may just forget about it, which is, which could be okay. Or it may push things back. Honestly, it's a bit of a double-edged sword there, but that's happened more than once. Betsy might be here already. Let's take a look inside. Like my uh, one of my most recent classes, my professor had a project deadline, a project that he kept. The, we had to do five projects. He eventually dropped the last project, or the fifth project, but the fourth project, our actual last project, he pushed back a little bit and kept saying, "Oh, I'll get it to you when Tuesday. I'll get it to you Wednesday. I'll get it to you Thursday. Actually, I'm gonna get it to you next week." And by that point, the term was basically over. Actually, I don't even know if I have my grades back for that yet. Like, I want to know how I did in the class. The term ended a week ago. <laughs> I'm gonna check that. Can I see that? Let's see. Is it updated yet? Please? Alright. Okay. 85, apparently? Overdue. Oh, no, no, no. No, that's fine. 85 with absolutely no comments on what I could have done better. Really appreciate the constructive criticism there, Teach. Whatever. Never made sense to me. I mean, if the term was still happening, then I could absolutely, like, tell them, like, hey, could you send me some feedback? I'd really love to know how I could improve upon this project, but nope, the term is over. Could email, but I really don't want to. Let's see, how did I do in that one? Uncurved score was a 362 out of 490. A minus. Not too bad at all. Could have been worse, honestly, with that class. With the amount of annoyance I experienced in that- This is my machine learning class, by the way, in case I've mentioned it before. With the amount of annoyance that I experienced in that class anyway, I'm happy to get an A-. minus. Dude was just creepy. Hi, Venti. Hi, Kaya. Time to write love poems. How fortuitous. Kaya, did you do your homework? Did you do your homework? I'm afraid I must disappoint you. I wrote a single word on the page, and that word was the, and then, well, that's as far as I got. <laughs> well, just because he ain't no model student doesn't mean he's not a student in general. We have to treat our students with equality. Everyone deserves an equal opportunity. Though, if you don't do your homework, I don't know, can't really meet you halfway. I can only meet you halfway if you, on your side, walk halfway as well. Been at it for a good while now. 
Huh. But math is fun. On the note of the homework that you were doing. Math is fun. I like math. I'm not a big history guy. American history was never one of my strong suits. Social studies was just not... Fun. Wasn't really interesting at the time. At the time, I was like, what does history have any... Effects on my life. Like, I'm never gonna know George Washington. Or need to know about the... All the different three-letter acronym organizations during the New Deal age. Like, I don't care. Half of them don't exist today. Well, maybe they do. I don't know. It was never interesting to me. Math and science was always my strong suit. <laughs> calculus. Fun. Calculus scary, but calculus fun. Oh, now I get to go talk to Nimrod. Nimrod is, from what I've been told, a Nimrod. Oh, you know what? I actually didn't check. Uh, They had some update summary. What else is new? I wish... Did they add more stuff at the bottom, maybe? Oh, update. Update, update, update. Okay. Slight delay occurs when Albedo releases his elemental skill. Travelers who were online at the time of the update have experienced an issue whereby Albedo is unable to use the elemental skill. Interesting. Very interesting indeed. Oh well. If I go back to here, can I actually see what other things are happening? How do I see the Windbloom menu? I did have a menu before. Where did that go? Notices mail. No. Maybe it's on which page? New. No, that's not it. Oh, I wish I remembered how to get back to that. Oh well. Oh wait, 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 wait. Wait, I just had it over top of it. It's events, isn't it? Yes, it is. Are these like things I can do? Festive challenges. Like what? Archery contests. Floral freefall. Ballads of Rees. Floral freefall. Is that like a match three thing? I am amazing with those. Oh, I see there's a shit ton of things to do in Mondstadt. All right, well, I guess I'll... I guess I'll just enjoy the Windbloom Festival. Windbloom Festival, indeed. Let's see, let me update that. And the Windbloom Festival. Yeah. Updated the stream title such that any of any denizens wandering through the categories section will know, ah, oh, I'm focusing on the Wind Festival right now. I think I'll begin doing that. Let's make sure that the world knows. Because I, I like to think of it this way. I've been trying to make changes to both, like, the go live notification that I usually use as well as the title that the stream is actually posted under. And think about, well, if I was looking through and browsing the channels, what would I want to know what's going on? Well, if, like, I was going through Genshin Impact during the events, I'd want to know who's doing event-related things and who's doing just, like, quest stuff and whatnot. So I think the stream title should be updated accordingly. And along with that too, I realize my go live notification has not for a while actually specified what game I'm playing. And if I'm on my phone and somebody goes live, I kind of want to know what they're playing so I know what I'm getting into. Like if I see that you're playing like, I don't know, some like League of Legends, I'm probably not going to tune in. I'm not a huge League of Legends person. But like if you're playing like, I don't know, Genshin Impact, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll pop in. I didn't realize it was you. Uh, it's like What's this. up, Nimrod? I'm planning to give a gift to my wife for the Windbloom Festival, and I wanted my drinking buddy Kaya to come up with a gift idea. Oh, Kaya's your. Uh, I... Kaya's your. Uh... I'm I'm a... Okay, is it Kaya or Kate? Over. I'm so confused. Kaya, I think it's Kaya. Your drinking buddy. But you're like always drinking. drinking. So aren't you your so own drinking buddy? Constantly arguing. Another day. Potentially. I can empathize. <laughs> I don't mind a drink or two myself. I don't mind a drink or two myself either. Judge, this I morning, it's orange C... It's, is it Kalon or Ceylon? It's tea. No, it's an area right. in Sri Lanka, I believe. I feel like I I'm gonna have consult to the Googie. Uh, Pronounce... Can you help me gather some Ceylon. I want to make a gift for her myself. Ceylon. I should have made it's apparently Ceylon. in advance. But I've barely been sober these last Salon. few days. Salon. Alright. 
When I woke up, Google say it's pronounced Salon. Orange Salon Pico T. Actually, well, now I need to know how to pronounce Pico E. Is it Pico E or Pico? Pico. 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 Oh, it is Pico. So if I say Orange Salon. Pico. A fool of myself in front of oh, it doesn't want to pronounce it like that. All right, that's fine. Done done. Spit it out then. Orange it Salon Pico T. I'm going to look for wood in the city. Salon is in, we'll you know, cutting my hair, which inside. I wouldn't want to get Those into my tea. I mean, pretty but nasty. I, ask you I just, I can just, them? honestly, if it's my own hair, I just pick it out. I, honestly, if it's somebody grass. else's hair, Small I mean, you ever go to a restaurant and you find hair in your food? Like, what would you do? Do you just, do you send it back? Because cause I'm the kind of guy who's just like, uh, whatever, I just pull the hair out and continue my meal. One, I don't want to be a hassle, and two, like, it's a single piece of hair, it's probably okay. I mean, I don't know, some people are a little more disgusted by that stuff than others. I guess the same thing, too. I've had, I've had, I've had mice in this apartment before, uh, but they're gone now, it's interesting. They disappeared after winter break, so they probably went to hibernate. But uh, they're not here anymore. Oh, and like, uh, I got no problem okay. with a couple of little me. mice. Like, Let's we're coexisting in this space, and I don't want to kill you or anything by putting out mouse traps. We're help. coexisting, but don't get into my food. If you get into my food, then I have a problem with you. Yo, what is up, Dez? How are you doing? What up, CJ? I think this is the first time that anybody on Twitch has called me CJ. I like it. It is indeed one of my many names, and I do appreciate oh, it. You. I hope you're thank doing you lovely. So much. I'm doing all right, too. These materials, but so, like, if you got mice straight away. hanging around, if so long as they're not in my food, I don't I don't really mind. Like, you're not causing you trouble for me. You'll spook, you like, don't come in my room either. The mice would sometimes peek their heads into our room and go into the dresser. We'd shoo them out, they'd go back. It's, it's like, I think the reason they came in was there are definitely holes in the walls behind my cabinets in my apartment because I can feel the breeze that comes through them. And I don't, I know that the mice come through those holes and I can't get back there. I've mentioned them to my landlord, but they're like, it's just too much of a construction to do. And I'm like, it's okay, it's fine. For the mice problem, they're just like, oh, here's rat poison and traps. And they're like, well, you know, they're not bothering me considerably. They never actually got into my food. I never found mouse droppings anywhere. So, and then they left, so it's no problem. But the same thing, like, what's that, that ew factor of you're walking around and maybe you see, like, in the streets of the city, you see, like, a little field mouse or something, and I'm like, ew, mouse! Or are you like, aw, woodland creature, just living its life, just like I am. I don't know. To each their own. To each their own. Speaking of that phrase, to each their own, I, uh, I was, uh, I saw some of my extended family over the weekend, um, on the other side of the family, the Anna side of the family, the fiance side of the family. They've got some pretty interesting views of life. But, like, all in all, to each their own, it's okay. You can feel however you want to, and think however you want to on things. It's your opinions, and that's okay. But so... It was interesting. I, they were talking about something. I don't want to get too specific into politics and whatnot, because honestly, this, this ain't the right place for it. But I was like, oh, well, in terms of X person's opinions, to each their own. And they were straight And they were straight up like, no, to not each their own. That's just wrong. And I was like, oh, okay, then. <laughs> That's the way you want to feel about it. That's the way you're going to feel. <laughs> I was like, whatever. Time to hand in your homework. Welcome back. I'm Fine, as always, shot. grabbing a Fanta. Go, go, go. Now, actually, I have a question for you, Des. I believe, oh, if I remember no correctly, right. you're over in India. Well, no so, over there, is Fanta made with the real sugar or with high fructose corn syrup? If, in case you can check the can, I am rather curious. Because when I went on my trip to Europe a few years ago, I believe European laws prohibit or some european laws prohibit the use of high fructose corn syrup so over there my at least my um one of our tour guides was like over here we call it fanta 
Fanta's without all the high fructose corn syrup in it. Over in America, it's Fanta because it has all the, the stuff in it. So is it is it Fanta or is it Fanta based off of that definition? I am curious. I mean, to my knowledge, it's only in Europe, but then again, for all I know, it could be that entire other side of the ocean. I am curious. I am very curious. Sugar! Fanta. Don't underestimate Perfect. The knowledge of the Knights of Favonius. In that case, a nice cold Fanta. Yeah, I love it. Fanta cook. Fa Fanta. Fanta. Again, to each their own. I don't know. I haven't talked to these people in like six or seven years, so maybe it's... It was probably just their opinions. Then again, I've actually never seen a Fanta commercial in like another language. So maybe they pronounce it Fanta. 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 I don't know. I know it is Fanta. So I will keep it as such. That was always a joke when we were overseas anyway. They're like, oh, this isn't Fanta. It's Fanta. It's the better soda. Because we're high class over here. We're high class overseas. The other side of the sea. Your side of the sea. Not my side of the sea. I wouldn't say that. America as a whole is incredibly high class. Then again, I don't know. Reminded you of a video, the mouse conversation? Go for it. Which video? Feel free to link the video in chat if you'd like to. I don't I don't prohibit the use of links. Unless they go to weird places. I'll usually click on them, and if it's bad, like I'll just I'll delete it. Honestly, my mouse conversation thought th made me think of the, the rat video, like rats. Rats. Where are the rats? Ozzy Man's commentaries. Oh, which which one's Ozzy Man? I recognize the name. I recognize the name, but I don't. I don't. Wait a minute. Is he the guy who sounds like Morgan Freeman? I need to check that. Ozzy Man. Ozzy Man reviews. No, it appears not. Is it? Oh, I can't remember. Hmm. Well, now we got a YouTube link, so we'll check it out. That intoxicated fellow you witnessed last time? Oh, the Aussie Man reviews. I, I remember it. It's the it's the ones where like he's screaming about things like, oh geez, it's the rat, and there he goes, and yeah. <laughs> he's chasing around the rat. Very well then. Nice. Oh my god, that's loud. Oh damn. <laughs> now I remember the Aussie Man reviews. I recall. Oh, oh jeez. Oh, <laughs> Rats just like, give me your toes. My god. They need all hands on deck. That rat's really going after that woman's toes. Lisa, humble, clear your toes look like pieces of sausage and I must bite on them, says the rat, not me, of course. Please do not be alarmed. I will keep my eyes on Lisa. I, I, uh, especially since she seems no to toes for me, thank you. People just to break up a scuffle, not to mention shocking drunkards until they well, now I'm wondering, because when you mentioned Ozzy Man, I thought of the dude on YouTube who makes comments about animals. True Facts, the True Facts series. It's a dude who kind of sounds like Morgan Freeman. It's like, true facts about the sea cucumber, or true facts about Morgan Freeman. I can't do a very good Morgan Freeman voice, but I try my best. But when you said Ozzy Man reviews, the first thing that I thought of was that. But now I remember, now I recall the Ozzy Man reviews of. Oh my goodness! Look at him go. There's definitely something going on here. My goodness! I there, I have nothing to narrate, so it's not not working well for me. Look at this girl going down the halls of the church. I wonder what kind of corruption exists within these holy walls. Goodness gracious! They're going up like that. Little girl says something. Barbara. This is sheer intimidation. I don't know. Bennett, what's wrong? How could somebody do this? Barbara, what's wrong? Huh? Context, young ones. Tell me what's going on. Use your words. I, I received a letter. Oh. And it says somebody built me a two-story tall it? flower. Let me. I just came back from the wilderness. As usual, I came by the cathedral to ask the sisters to back me up. That's when I saw Barbara running out. Why does a sheet? She was holding a letter. This letter I've made me crazy. Like this There's a fly. Can I take a look? I'm gonna get that fly. 
Dear Barbara, Barbara, I've stolen the thing most precious to you and buried it. Alright. What is precious to you? Intimidation? What could it be? What's your... thing? What if it's... I don't know. Well, can you tell us what is most precious to you? And that, well, I mean, perhaps that's a deep and dark, dirty secret. Hey, waypoint. I see a chest. I see... I see a chest. I see... I see a teleport marker. I see Stonehenge thing. Yeah, what is your... the thing that's most precious? I can't think at all. I can't even tell that... What the my the thing most precious to me is? Wait, <laughs> oh yeah, an Aussie man's Australian accent. <laughs> Though he is Australian, Aussie man, Aussie man is an Aussie man, so to speak. It really sells it. I don't know something about. I don't. Maybe it's just because. I was gonna say maybe it's because I believe. I, I can tell that he's got, like, a quote-unquote foreign accent, but I suppose every accent is considered foreign from my perspective because I don't believe myself to have an accent. I know I have an American accent because, well, na naturally, I, I have an American accent. Specifically, uh, I guess, I, su I suppose, a lower New England American accent, I suppose. Rosa Whoa, who are you? But yeah, accents are always... Oh, accents always make things more entertaining for me. I'm not sure what it is. I don't know if that's, like, exotifying accents in general, and I'm not sure if that's a bad thing to do or not. But alas, I do... I am more entertained by a narration with an accent. <clears throat> Rosaria. Rosaria is a sister of the Church of the Favonius. Church of... Church of Favonius. But you wouldn't know it except for her attire. It certainly won't find her saying prayers or attending church gatherings. If you need to find this elusive sister for anything, then you might be looking for quite a while. Check the hidden corners in the shadows, and you might just find Rosaria quick, quietly observing the rapid changes around Mondstadt. This mysterious sister is in fact guarding Mondstadt, just in her own way. Oh yeah, an Australian cursing just sounds... It's something else. If you've ever watched the Amazon Prime series, The Boy, The Boys, um, what's his face? Butcher. Billy Butcher. His cursing. His cursing is on point. I shan't repeat, because I try not to curse too much if I don't have to. Whatever. Anyway, so Rosaria is apparently a sister as well. You have a very interesting fashion sense. Very interesting. I hope you are comfortable. Do you really think they buried Jane underground? Jean's dead? Ex excuse me? So, sister, have you found any leads? The Boys is such a good show. The perpetrator seems to have Not appropriate for the youngings in the crowd, but a very good show nonetheless for those who are hiding something there. With parents' permission, I suppose I don't know, do whatever you want to. Watch The Boys, it's a good show. Who am I to stop you? It's a good one. It's one of those shows that make you think. I really enjoy shows that make you think. I believe the correct term is cerebral, but I suppose cerebral is different depending on the person, but there are some shows that are just labeled as cerebral, and I don't exactly know what that means in the genre sense of it all. But like, the boys made me think, I'd call that cerebral. You know what? And you, sister? Will you be accompanying Define cerebral. I knew straight away there was nothing to worry about. According to Miriam Webster, 1A, ever relating to the brain or the intellect. Nothing. B, going yeah, uh, but like... To Barbara, affecting or being the cerebrum, cerebral edema, Thank cerebral you. arteries. Alright. Okay. Ever relating to the brain. Sorry, well, right. it makes me done do the thinks, and the thinking happens in the brain, so, yes, every show is cerebral to a varying degree. What are we doing, Barbara? We're gonna find your idol's dead body hidden in the ground somewhere? Excuse me. And it's way over there. Well, what else is going on on around Mondstadt? Mondstadt. What other events, quests, things? 
World quest, commission quest. No, 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 no. I want to know about the Archon quest, story quest, event quests. No. Events. Festive challenges. Go to quest. Where is it? Uh, Cider Lake. During the Windwind festivals, stuff and whatever. Favonius. Lizzie introduced me to one of the highlights of this. Floral Freefall. That sounds really fun. That reminds me of um, a game that my fiance used to play on her tablet. Frozen Freefall. It was a match three type game. I like it's a puzzle game. I like puzzle games. I've always been a fan of like games like that. Bejeweled or Collapse. I love playing Bejeweled. The game of Bejeweled that I played the most was Bejeweled Blitz. Because it had all the different game modes and stuff. My favorite game mode on that, that and my brothers alike, um, was the the poker game mode. Where, like, you would try to match colors, multiple colors in a row. So you try to make, like, three or four, th up anywhere from three to five red gem matches in a row. And depending on whether you match, like, a three or a four or a five, you get some special power-ups and stuff like that. And the like. But that was always fun. I liked all the game modes on there. It was good. Hello, I'm Lizzie of the Knights of Favonius. I'm sure you've heard this already, but Mondstadt holds all kinds of fun activities during the Windbloom Festival. Rings a bell. I'm in charge of receiving all guests coming to Mondstadt in order to assure that everyone can get the most fun out of this festival. Because some festival events take place outside of the city walls, someone needs to introduce all of the available activities to the visitors. It'd be a shame if they missed the abundance of wonderful games that we've prepared. Now, allow me to wholeheartedly recommend our Bullseye Balloons. The name itself is pretty self-explanatory, isn't it? Shoot the targets as quickly and accuracy as you can to reach a high score. Enticing. Let's try it. No worries. Let me mark the location for you. You won't know unless you try it yourself. Besides, based on your score, you can win valuable rewards. No matter if you are a casual player or a perfectionist, it's fun all the same. I literally can't say no. Sure, you should definitely try it. If you want to learn more about other fun events, come find me. Have fun! Yes, tell me more... Bullseye Balloons. During the Wind Bloom Festival, corresponding event billboards will display the challenge locations for Bullseye Balloons. Once the challenge has begun, participants can and must accumulate points by shooting the right balloons down in succession. Only normal and charged attacks can be used to shoot these balloons down. Aim shots are counted as charged attacks. The challenge will end once time Festival. runs out. Different balloons will produce different effects when hit. The green balloon... The green bloom balloon will award points, while the orange bouquet balloons will provide a large number of points. Aside from this, the celebration balloons will explode and destroy surrounding balloons when popped, while the similar-looking heartbreak balloons will deduct points when popped. Oh, look at that. Hit multiple balloons in a short period of time to accumulate combo, which will increase the number of points awarded for each hit. Hitting a heartbreak balloon will interrupt your current combo. You can also enter bullseye balloons with friends in co-op sessions to test your shooting skills against each other. Come enjoy That's pretty cool. Let's, uh, let's try one of them. Uh, Bloom Balloon, Bouquet Balloon, Celebration Balloon, Heartbreak Balloon. Cool. Uh, yeah, let's do it. Go to challenge. Oh, it's way, it's way over there. Oh. Well, now I know that's on my map. Can I see where the other one is, too? Like, the other Bullseye Balloon location? Please move around the map quicker. No, perhaps not. Oh. Well, I know that's up there. Perhaps later. Tell me more about the other events. Uh, have you tried any of the events I recommended? But what about... I want Floral Freefall. Oh, brand new event. Floral Freefall? This event is really thrilling. If you're into adventuring, that might be something right up your alley. Jump down from way up high and float around through the air, screaming at the top of your lungs. Yahoo! If it weren't for my duties as a hostess, I'd be on my way, merry way there. Just like before, if your score is high enough, you can claim a reward. Cool. Try it out. Have fun. Give me the rules. During the Windbloom Festival, corresponding event billboards will display the challenge locations for floral freefall. Once the challenge has begun, participants will descend from a platform in the sky and collect a variety of flower Enjoy balls to obtain and festival. accumulate points. Touching the ground or running out of time will end the challenge. Collect different types of flower balls to obtain different amounts of points. Of these, the green fluorescent flower balls are worth 35 points, while the honey petal crowns made from orange windwheel asters are worth 200 points. The elaborate Finish line garland is worth 400. Aside from this, your remaining time will be converted into points once you complete the challenge. Each second remaining is worth 10 points. 
You can also enter Floral Freefall with friends in co-op sessions and compete one Come with one another. Wonderful. Where's that one? Dusty Balloon. Where's that one at? That's down there. Can I see the other one, though? Okay, so I can actually see where those things are on the map. That's lovely. I'll make my way over that way when I figure out the other ones. Yes, recommendation. Ballads, ballads of Breeze. Feel the breath of the wind. Not the breath of the wild. Feel the breath of the wind atop mountains and besides rivers and put your heart and soul into playing your tune. It's a surefire way to forget all your worries. Don't worry, this activity was designed pre precisely such that those without any performance can savor the joys of music. As long as you can keep up with the hints and the beat, there should be no problem. Cool. Of course, happy Wind Blue Festival. Give me the rules. You can test your performance skills in Ballads of Breeze through the Invitation of Windbloom event menu. Follow the rhythm and the hints provided by the gradually shrinking rhythm rings to press the corresponding buttons at the right time. Getting the rhythm right will award points. Your performance will be graded afterward according to the points you obtained. The rhythm rings will appear before the beat and will shrink over time. When the rhythm ring aligns precisely with the button pressing area, it is time to press the button and play some music. But get it wrong and you'll miss the beat. Accurate play allows you to increase the combo count. When your combo count reaches a certain point, accurate play will award more points. Watch out, though. A missed note will send your combo count up in smoke. Coming. That sounds really fun. I love rhythm-based games. Uh, begin performance. Normal. Let's try it. Alright. I can't see myself. Alright. Well, this is nice. That's pretty cool. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. I've never actually played a game such as this. This type of rhythm game. I think the closest thing I've ever actually played to a rhythm game, for realsies, is like, um, was it Crypt of the Necro Dancer? I played that a little bit. That was fun. This is beautiful too. The theme is just lovely. Lovely. Oh, it seems I'm almost done. Oh, I missed one. Whoops. Not too bad. Rank dual chem. Cool. Dual chem like dulces? Like sweet? I'll claim my gift. Oh, sweet. Tickets. Very wonderful. Uh, let's try early dawn. This is fun. This song is very reminiscent of another song that I know. It sounds almost like a Christmas song. Whoops. I just know. I just remembered too. I'm on a little bit of a sound delay, so I'm trying to click the buttons in beat with the music that I'm hearing, and it's a little off. I was like, why, are, why isn't this aligning up with what I need it to be? Rank, Dulcem. I'm gonna, I'm gonna guess that Dulcem is pretty good. Razor score was 800. Cool. Good for you, wolf boy. You can pluck the strings. We're all very proud of you. Uh, yeah. I don't think I need to do that again. 
Unlocks in 18 hours. Oh, I see. More become available over time. I'm going to try hard mode and see what happens. Yeah, I guess Dilchin is... I suppose I'll probably do worse on this one, so we'll see what's below Dilchin. Very calming music. I always really enjoyed the music in this game. I've probably said it before, but it bears repeating. Got the two for that time. Oh, dear miss, dearie, dearest me. My voice is a little tired from the weekend, so I'm probably off key a bit. Euphonia! All right. Oh, perhaps the first letter is what determines. Hmm. So is Dulcim just a B? Or a D? Maybe it is. Oh, well. I tried my best. Us. It's too hard on this one. Let's try it. Oh, they came in at both sides. Unfortunate. That one was tricky. Not too bad. Honestly, could have gone much worse. Dulcem? Dulcem. Wonderful. That was pretty fun. I enjoyed that. I enjoyed that considerably. I guess I have to be at the other location for those other ones. That was cool. We'll do that again sometime later. And now that I have these tickets, I suppose I can spend them in a shop somewhere? I did not mean to hit you. Cower in fear. No, don't hit me. Let's see. Uh, festive anecdotes? Oh, I should probably go to the item shop. Well, what is festive anecdotes? I got quest. Alright. Uh, no. Get other quest. Quiet, please, in the library. This is a library. My god, man, this is a library. Quiet yourself down. Buttons, Cameron. Click the buttons. Character is currently involved in other quests. Cannot join this quest. Okay. Gotcha, Margaret. List of challenges. Peculiar Wonderland. An ever-changing domain of enigmatic composition of rarely seen challenges known in adventurous tales as the Peculiar Wonderland. Each time you enter the Peculiar Wonderland, you will face three special random peculiar challenges. And based on how much fecundity... You accumulate during these challenges, you will obtain all manner of blessings that will boost your strength during the peculiar trial at the very end of the Wonderland. Fecundity? Fecundity? That was definitely a vocab word at some point in my life. Let's go to the item shop. What can I buy with 400 tickets? Ah, a crown. A precious talent level up material. I can only purchase one. And I have enough for it. So let's do that. Yeah. 
Now I've got that. What else can I buy? Oh, they're all like talent level up materials. I suppose it's worth it to just get a bunch of these. Oh, I can get more. That's pretty cool. Commemorative balloon. Use this to release a balloon that can be popped. Aw. That's cute. Oops. It's warm enough in here. Time to start using electricity. Oh, there's different types of collab coupons. Dust of Azov. Very interesting. Alrighty then. Pretty cool. Time to continue on to the next event. Whatever's next. Uh, event quests. Or rather, rather, the story. Story quest. Which is... In the meantime, I'll go after the, uh... See that one. Commission quests, too. Blocked? Again? As always. Always blocked. <gasps> dandelions. Those dandelions. Blow those dandelions away. Sometime in my life, I definitely want to actually try dandelion wine. Just curious of what it tastes like. I wonder if it's as bitter as dandelions seem to be on their own. When they're still yellow, not when they become all white and poofy. Oh, you are over there. What gotta do about that? What I gotta do to unblock the road? Mushrooms. Mushrooms on the ground. You've blocked the way, you assholes. I will end you with fire. After cycling through all of my party, I've decided on this one. What will I do about it? All right, everybody, get in. Everybody, get on in. Stop. Yep. You know, swirl it. Swirl it. Swirl it. Yes. Swirl it. I say. Take care of every single one of them, except for the big guys and the other one. Enough of that. Easy. Easy. That's easy mode. I've helped you. And in return, I request your never-ending gratitude. And a life of indentured servitude. Oh, sweet. Adventure rank 28. Lovely. I'll collect my rewards. Image. Uh, next quest. Probably close by, right? Spreading evil. Where does that evil spread? Ah, does evil spread up there? I shall unspread the evil. Why are you hiding behind that bush? S sir? Sir, are you out? Oh, you're not hiding. You're just... You're just hanging. Wonder how Glory is doing. I wish I could return to Mondstadt to see her, but I can't. How can I let her know that her lover is a coward and a deserter? Lover. Have you two gotten it on? It's disgusting. The best I can do now is clear out monsters and do my part to predict Mondstadt and her. Laugh if you want. I'm... I'm a useless man. All right. Ha! Ha ha! Ha! I don't think you're useless. I just think you're annoying. But hey, if the Knights of Favonius get paid to sit around and pick dandelions all day, seems like a pretty good gig. Like a pretty good gig indeed. What's happening up here? It's a blue thing! What is this? 
little ley line outcropping. Touch the ley line. Touch the ley line. Can do. Oh, no, no. Water's not fun. Alright, fine. We'll take care of you then. You. You just. You just don't know when to stop. Oh, stop that. Get out of here. Y'all just don't know when to stop, do you? Yeah, yeah, ah. Oh, and now you're gonna electrify me? You bastard. Take that. Fire, fire, burning. Swirl. Swirl. Alright. Swirl, 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 swirl. Fire. She's fire burning. Fire burning on the dance floor. Shoddy is most definitely and certainly fire burning on the dance floor. So can somebody call 911? Because she's literally on fire. Like that girl over there. That girl is on fire. She's really on fire. Currently in a great conflagration. Somebody help her. Oh god, she's on fire. Back and done till 11.50. Welcome back, Dakota. Welcome back, indeed. Touch the ley line? I'll touch the ley line. That's no problem. What did I get? Awesome! I got stuff. Stuff's good. I like stuff. And, uh, onward toward the other daily quest. Huh, I've downright run out of tea. Should probably make some more tea for myself. What kind of tea, though? I'm unsure. Oh, adjust my chair accordingly. Accordingly, I say, as if that has anything to do with my tea choice. No, no, can we, can we, I, I came here for this reason. Uh, can we, yes, melt, please, please, there we go. Yes, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. And we'll take care of this one. What kind of tea do I usually drink? I have a vast collection of teas. There is no usual tea. It's merely what's in my collection at any given time. But I shall name a couple of options. I know I have some chai tea. I have some lapsung sichang tea, which is very smoky. I have some jasmine pearl tea. I have hibiscus tea. There's a rose petal tea in there. I think I might be getting that mixed up with the hibiscus. What else is in there? There's some English breakfast teas that I stole from an organization the other day. Stole is in like, they're like, oh, here's your coffee and tea bags. And I'm like, oh, I'm not drinking the tea now, but I will definitely save it till later. And there's probably a couple other things in there too. There's green tea. There's black tea. Just general Whole Foods brand. There's more of the black salon. Uh, Pico tea. A lot of fancy tea words. There might be an Irish breakfast in there somewhere. Potentially. And there may be Earl Grey as well. Or Lady Grey. There's definitely Lady Grey. There's definitely Lady Grey tea in there. I do like me a nice Lady Grey. I haven't had that one in a while. Hmm. That's kind of calling to me if I can find it. I have an entire drawer. It's just got tea in it. It used to be the coffee and tea drawer. But eventually the amount of tea that was in there uh, outweighed. It's just It was just too much. Oh, well, you need to heal. Eventually, I ran out of space for everything. Green tea's good. Green tea's very good. Any particular type of green tea? Like a... I don't know. Like a matcha green or... Sencha. Which are the only two green teas I know by name. Matcha and Sencha. I read a book a while ago. Called Serendipity. Um, I think it's by a guy named... Podrica, who actually owns a company by the same name, but it went through all the different types of teas and stuff. I had a I have a bunch of notes on them somewhere. Missive of Cloud and Fog. Well, these ones are far away, so let's continue on to the event quest and move on that way. Types of green tea. Oh yeah, not just the not just the tea that turns the water green. Indeed. Granted, if you bought like. If you ordered, like, green tea from a restaurant, they're probably not going to ask you which type. It'll more than likely just be whatever they have. Um, I don't know. 
for all I know, they're not actually different types, and it's just the box is trying to be like, oh, no, 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 we're different than the other green teas. Like, oh, are you? Yes, of course we are. Oh, I doubt that. But they do have slightly different taste. I will say matcha, matcha is very bitter. It's a very bitter green tea. It's kind of astringent. Sencha is different. It's it's a little more laid back. It's not as bitter. But it's got a completely different taste to it. I honestly really don't like Sencha. The Sencha green teas. It's like very um I don't know, it's almost it's almost like a smooth creaminess to it. Kind of the way like I guess I guess that's pretty similar to matcha then. Cuz usually like Dunkin Donuts is these matcha lattes. I tried one of them and was like, "Oh, no, no." Not not so cool. Not not a fan. It was just too bitter. But I suppose if you add sugar to it, add a little bit of cream, that can fix that. If that's your thing. I like I like bitter things. But not necessarily astringent. Though it really depends. I'm really not picky. I'm not a picky guy when it comes to my teas. I think I'll probably You know what? If I have Sencha green tea. I'll make that because I honestly forget what it tastes like. It's been so long. In the meantime, I'll check and see what other types of green teas that I have. If I'm correct in saying, if I remember from the book that I read, green teas are just like they're meant to be, they're not meant to be steeped as long as say black tea or perhaps it's longer. No, I think I'm getting that mixed up. Don't quote me on any of this. I am no expert. Merely a fan. A fan of tea, a fan of coffee, a fan of all a fan of all things beverages. I like beverages. Beverage is good. No, oh, and now that I'm on top of this. Yeah. What a lovely towering house. In the meantime. I'm gonna go grab more tea for myself and fill myself up on water. Be back in a moment.
And I'm back. Got some more tea. As it turns out, I had two packages, two, two tea bags of Sencha green tea left. Normally, I really wish I could make my tea in the tea kettle, but I honestly did not have the patience for it this morning. So, hot water from a cure rig into a cup with a bag. The funny thing is, too, this particular tea is bagged by the London Tea Company. And the only time that I've ever been ha had access to the London Tea Company tea bags was on a cruise that I went on with my family. A year ago and so I have a couple of tea bags left from that trip uh, this being one of them so I'm not sure if this tea is going to taste correct I suppose because it's been sitting in there for over a year probably because I remember telling myself that I wasn't a big fan of it so naturally why would I drink it if I wasn't a fan of it but the flavor is lost on me so I have to try it again Eventually, when it cools down, it is much too hot for my palate right now. Kill the fishies. Kill the fishies. Take the fishies. Fishies? Fishies. Kill fishies. Now I'm over here to find that which Barba loves most buried in the ground. I'll try not to die. I'll try. But if I die on camera, tell no one. Just, just leave. If I die on camera, don't tell anybody. Just leave. Go about your business. Somebody will find me eventually. And we'll have no problems. Or perhaps I suppose the law would tell you, no, 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 do stick around. Um, call the police. And uh, be a witness. But I'm not going to hold you accountable like that. I'm not a police officer. Sometimes I'm hardly a law-abiding citizen myself. This seems like a challenge. Let's try it. Who's out here? Who's out here? Fire, dude. Overloaded. Yeah, let's do that. Take your shield down. Come on, please. Please, 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 please. There we go. Someone needs assistance. And just, just whap you. Whap you till you're dead. Right? I don't think I have enough time for all these guys. Alright, that's one defeated. And if only. Alright, let's do this. Don't do that. Don't, don't. Please, of all the things you could possibly do, don't do that. Or perhaps just take out one of them first. Yeah, okay. And then have this Guoba over there. No, what are you doing? Stop that, don't do that. Here, and don't... I don't want you to regain your shields. Oh, come on now. Nope, alright, it's... I think it'll work. No, stop! Uh, I've been frozen. Oh, I tried my best. I'm not powerful enough just yet. Not powerful enough just yet. Hello, storks. Goodbye, storks. Springvale. One of the characters earlier mentioned Springvale. Huh. I haven't cooked for in a while. And I have a ton of ingredients. I know this only because I bought a shit ton of ingredients. Some ingredients I have literally over a hundred of because I spent all my money on it. Because I can. Let's see. What haven't I made yet? Jade parcels. I'm not yet proficient in that. Let's make some of them. And Zhangling will be the one to help me. Dink. 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 Cooking time, cooking time. Got a lot of cooking time. Insufficient ingredients. Gotcha. The golden chicken burger. That sounds lovely. Let's make some of those. Barbara. Barbara girl. The one who makes burgers better than anybody. Apparently. My inner completionist is just like, become proficient with all. Oh, I have no more fowl. Oh well, guess I need to kill more birds. Northern apple stew. Not yet proficient with that one. 
Barbara's back. Cooking more stuff. If only cooking worked this way in real life. Ha ha ha, but you've never heard somebody playing a video game say that before. Nah, I honestly, I'd rather cooking not work like this in real life. Because if it ever did, there'd be glass and metal in my food. Clearly, do you see the pepper shaker? I feel like they'd be... Or perhaps in this universe, the glass and the... Um, the glass and the metal actually add a certain je ne sais quoi to the dish. Cold cut platter. With jungling. Not proficient in that just yet. But yes, my inner completionist says, become proficient in everything. And uh, when I have the opportunity, opportunity to, I do. Honestly, what I should be doing is instead make healing items because, or healing foods, because I always seem to run low on that. And don't have them when I need them in battle. Alright, what else is Healy Heal? You're Healy Heal, and so are you. And I've run out of meat, I believe. I've run out of meat! Any more Healy Heals? Aw, oh, the flaming red Bolognese. I need more meat, but I have no meat. What else am I not yet uh, proficient in? Fragrant mashed potatoes. I have a lot of tomato potatoes, and I'm guessing that's sour cream. Can I make more of that? Cream? Yes, yeah, so let's just make a bunch of cream. More cream. I must have more cream. Confirm. Yeah, that'll finish eventually. Oh, it's a long one. Perfect. And plus with jungling too, I can get double. Which is cool. That's always good. It's always nice. I wonder if my tea's all warm now. Nope. Still scalding hot. I'm not putting that in my mouth yet. It's a balancing act, you see. Before putting anything in your mouth, you have to find the right moment. And I'm out of cream. What about this one? Jewelry soup. Sounds lovely. Perfect cooking for defense-based. 12% chance? Ah, they're both. They're both okay. This is why I collect all these ingredients. I collect ingredients for the particular purpose of making food that I will probably never use. Because <laughs> I'm very bad at using items. Except in Super Smash Brothers, I love to use items in Super Smash Brothers because one thing that people, I, I, anytime I've played, the one thing people don't necessarily do is they take the items and they throw them across the stage, which works surprisingly well. Let's make some almond tofu with chocolate. Cook manually, because I am not yet proficient in any of these dishes, which is nice. Usually. A couple of uh, dishes, let's see. Think about words before you say them. There are many dishes that I'm already proficient in. But there are many, many more dishes that I am not proficient in. And that's good. Did I run out of ingredients? I'm almost proficient. Star Chef. Ah, yes. Automatic cooking unlocked. Oh, I'm in tofu. What about this one? Character bonus, perfect. Make some more dishes. Oh, out of ingredients. And I'm proficient in these ones. I don't really need any more. Did I finish my cream? No, okay. Each cream takes three minutes. So that is going to take three times 50, 150 minutes. All right. A couple, uh, an hour or two. Almost three. Well, not almost if you round up. Oh, now you're telling me I got a crown of insight? Wait, when did I get that crown of insight? I got that a while ago. Or perhaps... Hmm. The Art of Adventure. Master 10 recipes. Gotcha. Grasp how 40 different dishes are made. And I've got 23. That's cool. I love achievements. I love achievements. Before, like, video games had achievements, per se, I was... Mushrooms were great. That's cool. Mushroom pizza. Yeah, yeah, I like that. Cool. Thanks. Thanks, sign. 
But uh, before games had, like, achievements, per se, that are trackable, like, with Steam or Xbox, I would always be really enthused by... I don't want to... Oh, went drinking. Nice. But I always like the... Um, like, some games have, like, collections where you collect items, and you collect them just for the purpose of being a complete completer. And then you had bragging rights. Like, hey, I got all the items in... I don't know, some game that has collectibles. Which, for some reason, I can't think of any right now that I've played. And then friends would be like, that's cool. Unless they also play the game, in which they'd be like, yo, that's awesome! Tell me how you did it! But, uh... What is shaking? Something on my desk was shaking. But like when I was younger, I didn't I never really played video games socially. It was always just a thing I did on my own in my house with my brothers, which if I played with them, that was social. I'll catch up. But even then that didn't happen too too often. Oh, it's my it's the cable for the controller whacking the table. Nice. So, like, I would never really go to school and be like, yo, guess what I did in my video game that you definitely also play? Like, I just wouldn't do that. Because I didn't think anybody was interested. Hey there, pals. You see my friend Jean? If you have, then I'm going to assume she's dead and she's here. You bastards. I cannot move. Yeah. Oh, what is happening? Alrighty, then. No, let's not fry. Swirl. Swirl, I say. I did it. I dig, and I find <gasps> Master Jean. What is this? <laughs> Quick, let's open it. I, I, I don't want to open it. What if it's Master Jean? What if she's dead? We couldn't have just checked her office first. What's it doing out here in the wilderness? It's so that no one can hide the bot. No one will find the body. All right. <laughs> is somebody trying to get your attention? Hmm. Looks like our perpetrator is really just one of Barbara's fans. Could you could you imagine getting a letter in the mail like I've stolen what's most precious to you and bury it hit here? You go and it's just like a love letter, like, oh, I buried my feelings for you, which you obviously feel so inclined to agree your mutual feelings for. Like, no. This is harassment. Don't do that. Fraudulent intimidation, then? Fraudulent intimidation. Magic. Flowers should be offered in utmost sincerity. It's the most important ceremony of the Windbloom Festival. Flowers of love and blessings sent on such a special occasion. No effort should be spared to make it spectacular. Be spectacular. Be amazing. Give flowers to your loved ones. Flowers are not forever. They will die, like your loved one one day. That's why I buy perennials. You plant them in the ground, they keep coming back up every single year. But my loved ones will not do that. I have a suspect in mind who fits that description. Who? Who? Anyway, now sports with Paimon. <laughs> I'd like Paimon to make a few guesses. Still too hot. You're so annoying. Well, it's a good thing it's not a dead body. That'd be unfortunate. Quest to complete. Now what? Flowers. I got an animo sigil. Oh, uh, let's see. Uh, I suppose there's more, right? Oh, is... Or maybe... Excuse me. Perhaps that quest is not unlocked yet. No? No. Aww. Outland Gristana, g Gastronomy. Hello. Nice to meet you. Hi, Hi. Zhongling. Bye, Zhongling. Windborn Bard. Confirm? Nah. Hello. Hello. Uh... Was it this one? Ah, is this unlocks after 17 hours? Okay, so I cannot do that yet. Ah! Well, I guess I have other things that I can do. 
Let's continue. Let's continue with the daily quests. Take care of those. Um, and then I'll head back to Mondstadt. I'll get the adventure rank rewards. I'll get the daily reward. And I will continue on the Windblue missions. That's the plan. That's the plan. That's the plan, Sam. All you Sams in the audience. In case you were wondering what the plan was, this is indeed that plan. Why say that's the plan, Sam? Plan and Sam are only very rough rhymes with each other. Because plan has an N -na -na at the end, and Sam has an M -ma -ma at the end. Oh, wait, that's because I'm saying it incorrectly. Stan. Stan. To all you Stans in the audience, that is the plan. To all the Sams in the crowd, consider yourselves enlightened. Consider yourselves lucky. Hi, guys! Time to die. Leave it all to me. Oh, and who's got me all wet now? Stop that. I don't want to be wet. Silence, wench. I do not wish to be wet anymore. I just want to be happy. <laughs> Let's get some fire. Fire burn, fire burn. Oh, sweet. And now your shield's on fire. Incredible. Swirl. 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 Ha <laughs> ha, swirl. I love swirl. And speaking of which, maybe one of the things that I should do today is figure, uh, figure Venti out. Because I have Venti as a character now, and I should really try him out. Use him as a character. I need to set up a different party for myself. Oh, come on now. Come over here. Come here. Yeah. Jeff. Now you're dead. Oh. Oh. These enemies have very funny sounds when they die. Like, the big guy was just like, Oh! Oh! Oh, look. What a totally unbreakable wall. Let's see what happens when I hit it. Hmm. Who knew? Breaking off these crystal chunks. Now I've got a bunch of them. What do I use with these? Nothing. Apparently, I, I still remember, I have a quest from the blacksmith to go to Storm Terror's domain and find crystal shard things or whatever. I don't know. I gotta go there, apparently, too. Oh, there's just so many things to do in this game. I'm overwhelmed by the possibilities. Overwhelmed by the possibilities and the opportunities. And yeah, I'll open that chest now. After I collect whatever's in these boxes, which is nothing! Instructor's cap. It's time to continue on my mission. There's apparently something else up in that direction. And it's locked on the map. I wonder if I'm at the correct adventure rank to be able to, at the very least, unlock it as a teleport point. <gasps> Look at you. You're not far. There we go. Much more easily broken with the debate club. The club of debate. The club that's up for debate. What's up for debate today? Green tea and its various forms. Good or annoying or deceptively similar. Find out more today at 1130. Which is in two minutes. Well then. Recommended party level 38. Uh, I can actually do that. Realm of slumber. Massive cryo energy. Interesting. I can get adventure stuff. Whatever that is. Current party level is lower than recommended. I can do this. Do I want to, though? Yeah, why not? I stumbled upon it. Let's do it. Why not? Yeah. Let's take these guys. Let's do it. I'm not sure if I was supposed to or not, but I've never been the kind of guy to do what I was supposed to do anyway. Leyline Disorder, your character will be periodically inflicted with condensed ice, greatly increasing your stamina consumption until the inflicted cryo element is re removed. Oh, this is one of these things. Oh, I see. Wonderful. Let's see what happens up here. Ooh, it's so pretty. But now it's almost 1130, so I think it's time to drink some green tea and see what happens. Ah, that's what I remember of the, the... 
the center green tea. All right. If you've ever had broccoli rob without oil, without salt or anything, but basically just like like the leaves of the block bro ugh, broccoli plant, but just like boiled in water. That's what it tastes like. It tastes almost like soggy. It's not a, it's not bad. It's just different. That's kind of what it tastes like. It's not astringent. It is indeed smoother than, say, matcha would be. But it is most certainly not um, similar to... I mean, it's similar to green teas. It's not, like, the same as what I would consider, like, a regular green tea to be. It's very bro broccoli robby. Broccoli robby? Broccoli, broccoli rob like like sogginess almost like soggy gym clothes no not gym clothes soggy gym clothes would imply that they also smell sweaty and smell weird uh no i don't think it smells bad it smells bad yeah not really smell bad it doesn't really smell bad at all perhaps i should be using my abilities no chance Swirl! Swirl! Everybody swirl! Everybody do the swirl! Forgot to do the hit at the end. Nope, stop. I don't know what you're doing. I don't like it. Hey, cut it out. Let's take care of you. You're uh, annoying. I've almost defeated them all. There's probably one more big, right? Big one in the center. Who's it gonna be? And it's you. Yeah, I'm gonna kill you. I am most definitely going to have no mercy on you and kill you dead. Bye bye. Swirl. Swirl. Wonderful. That was lovely. Clear time. Three. I must touch the blossom. Oh, that's what these things are for. They're for, like, level-up materials. Duh. I wonder if this is one of the ones for venti- Ascension materials, not necessarily level-up materials. Ascension materials. Wonderful. Three teachings of Balad. Very lovely. Very nice. Oh, did I do it again? I don't want to do that. Yeah, I'll leave. Challenge failed. Oh well. <laughs> and you failed! Speaking of which, that class from before, I saw my other grades, but... What's my final score? Do I know yet? No, of course I don't! Whatever. You know what's important? I passed my law class. That's all I was worried about. Oh, I need my quest back on the map. Increasing danger. Tell me where to go. Up on this ridge, you say? Absolutely, I'll do that. Up. 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 How tall is this mountain? Oh, it's not too bad. I've climbed taller. All right. Over to that ridge over there. Anything in this little pond? No. Nothing important. Despite the fact that the sun really isn't out today. I mean, I suppose because the sun is not out today, it is a perfect day to just hang inside. Hang inside and enjoy one's company. I don't have anything else to do today or merely this week. So I don't have to rush around either. I don't have to go anywhere. Actually, well, I do need to go to the store and pick up cold cuts. I'm out of salami. And other forms of cold cut meat. Hey there, pal. What's up there, whopper flower? Oh, I have hair on my ear. Ah, itchy. Here we go. Oh, come back here, you. Get swirled. No, come back. Yes. Swirl. Swirl, girl. 
Sucrose is the swirl girl. And that's okay with me. And now, what the hell is happening over here? Random event as well? Yeah. Hello! How can I help you? Chef. What's up, chef? A few more ingredients to go. What's happening? Hmm, a traveler. I'm just adding the finishing touches to an ancient recipe. Not long ago, a team of explorers went on an expedition to the mountains. One of them is a friend of mine, an adventurer. They didn't make it very far due to bad weather conditions, but my friend did tell me that they happened upon an ancient ruin while they were taking shelter from the storm. It was full of books and other records, uh, even a recipe. I don't know how to survive the attack for this long. My adventurer friend passed the recipe on to me. He hopes I can revive the taste of the past. In fact, I've never even heard of some of the ingredients that the recipe requires. Even some of the cooking techniques are new to me. So I'm cooking a modified version which only uses the most essential ingredients. Would you be willing to help me gather the unusual ingredients for the recipe? Fine. Nice to see you're so enthusiastic about this. I heard that a few boars somehow got lost in the mountains and became encased in ice. I'm curious to find out how such an ordeal affects the flavor of the meat. So perhaps you could fetch me ten portions of chilled meat. Yeah, I got that, so. Yes, meat from the frozen boar being encased in ice must keep it pretty fresh, don't you think? So when someone tells me about some poor boar trapped in the ice, all I hear is... Evisceration. Thanks for doing this for me. Come and find me once you've got the ingredients. I think I have ten portions already. Oh, I only have six. Uh -huh. Interesting. I need to kill more iced boars. No mercy by my hands. None. I must destroy the towers. That's it. I must leave no stone unturned. Don't come near me or you'll get a whack of the debate club. Alrighty then. I did that. Now let's do the same exact thing. But over here. I wouldn't throw bombs at your own tower that you're trying to protect. And any reinforcements, you wouldn't. Alright, I did it. Commission complete. Oh, come on. Swirl, I say. Suck them in. Oh, stop that. Oh, stop that. Don't get all up in my grill. Or do. Just be prepared. Be prepared to deal with the consequences. I will kill you. Stop. Aw, you're not on fire. I thought surely you'd be on fire. And now you're dead. And you're dead. Can I, can I please, can I, can I come up with the, the tower? Please, I want to get you the tower. Sucrose. Knock them down. Um, hello. Can we, can we help out there? Oh. And can I climb? Can I climb? I'd like to climb. Can I climb? Climb, please? No? All right, then. Um, and what should I do about that? Needs I don't know. Get up here. Ah, come on. There we go. I just keep doing this. There you go. Hope you're enjoying your tower up there, pal. <laughs> come on. Die. Please. Thank you. And the next commission quest is... Impregnable Defense. And it's over there. Is it on the other side of Dragonspine? Is it Dragonspine time? Oh, it's actually in Dragonspine. Incredible. All right. Cool. I don't have the warming bottles. Or do I? Do I? Do I? Do I have the warming bottles? Yes, I do. Emits heat for a short period over a small area, diminishing the effect of sheer cold. Oh, it's not like, does it stay on me? Ah, whatever. That'd be convenient if it did. 
Are there any challenges that I can see from up here that I have yet to complete? I see a broken bridge. Little area down there. Let's head up this side of the mountain. And see what I may find in Dragon Spine this time. I'm not sure how long I will be in Dragon Spine, but let's see. I will change. Change the title to reflect that. There we go. Title updated. Now the world knows exactly what's going on. Now the world knows what I'm all about. In case the world was curious. Hi there, pal. Hey there. Hey there, hi there. Who there? How you doing there, pal, today? You didn't seem like you were hurting anybody, but... Oh, you're... You didn't seem like you were hurting anybody, and it looked like you were minding your own business, but you know what? You had a health bar, so that means I can and will kill you. I wonder if he had a family. Maybe even children. The question is now irrelevant. <gasps> Hi, guys. You also seemed like you were just minding your own business, but you just... I don't know. Maybe you were asking for it. Oh, did I just... I just knock out the fire for myself? I think I did. Oh. I put out the fire. I didn't mean to do that. I guess that's one side, downside of the swirl. That's okay. I can just do this. Nope. Um, Guova, please. Thank you. I wonder if they updated Guova, because Guova didn't used to um, aim towards the things that can be set on fire. Emergency supply points. Gotcha. It's all empty. Yeah, same shit. Different day. We've seen it all before. Warm me up. Warm me up inside. Hey, what's up there, pal? Die. All meats. Cool. More meats. Is there a chest here that I'm interested in? No, not really. Sorry, pals. You're not really worth my time. Pinecone. But the pinecone is... Let's warm up over here and see how many pieces do I have. I should just use this menu. Nope, wrong one. I should use this menu. Proceeds to click the wrong button, as per the usual. What is this thing? Animunculus Resonance Stone. Oh! I can do that. I didn't know I could do that. Destroy? How did I do that? Huh. Um, I got books. Any, uh... I have three of them. Okay, cool. I have 18 Joculus. Very cool. Very cool. Very legal. Someone needs assistance. So there's that, and I don't know. Nice Guava, do your thing. What is it? Raw meat! Go up in flames! Hi there, pal. Hey there. Swirl. Ice cold like my heart. Or rather, the deepest parts of my heart. The outside feels just fine. Perhaps this is exactly what I needed. Oh, okay. Aw, you put up your shield. Why you gotta do that? Why you gotta go into the shield thing? It's not fun. There we go. You bother me. Okay. So I'm here now. Oh, I need the warmth. Oh, goodness. That didn't help. Set on fire. Nope. Other way, please. Nope. No. No, no. No. No, no. No, no. No, 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 no. Oh, jeez. Come on. Quoba. Quoba, come on, dude. Stop! No, why'd you go in that direction? That's... No! Stop that. There we go. 
Boba, come on. Come on, dude. That thing I said before about maybe changing Guoba to go towards the... Yeah, it's, it's not a thing. I was here before. I have been here before. Nothing of interest. Moving right along. It'd be cool if I could find that door. That door that I was obsessing over last time, which I could not seem to find. Oh well. This will be one of the. It'll be one of those things that when I'm not looking for it, I will find it. Like I, I know I will be. I know I will be able to. Let's see. And I see a crimson wish up in that direction. So I'll take care of that. Please die. Whatever you do, at the very least, please allow your existence to snuff out. Someone needs assistance. Hey yo. I'm the one who requires assistance. Hey. Hey, what's up? Stop that. Stop belly bouncing me. Weirdos. Aw, oh, come on now. The swirl went into the wall. No. Hit the fire ground. Yay. Swirl it up. Oh, it's actually having some AoE effect. That's pretty cool. If I just keep doing this... Uh, <laughs> your ice ability, sir. What are you doing? It's really not doing... Oh, actually, that hit me pretty good. No, I think you just need to chill out. I will get in the way. It is actually my job to get in the way, so to speak. Disgusting. Disgusting. Oh, food. Cold food. Disgusting. Is that what you said? Was it cold food or warm food? Disgusting. Because, like, you're the freezy dude. I would assume cold food would be, like, your favorite or something. And this is the area with... That thing up there, which needs to be unlocked. Let's let's try it. Doesn't usually work, but Are you know what I wish you know what I could probably do? What if I shoot an arrow up there? I didn't even think about that. Can I shoot a projectile at it? I didn't even think about that. I hadn't even considered that possibility. Where's the ice? Oh, ice way over there. Nah, it went away. Unfortunate. Oh well, onwards to the Crimson Wish. And that's up there, I suppose. So. Up the mountain. Up we go. Up the mountain. Oh, up the mountain. There's a bridge up there. Yeah, there's probably a landing. I went through this, these areas so many times, I feel like I actually feel, like, familiar with them. Now, let's see. You're in this general direction. Do I just have to kill these dudes? Is that all I must do? Defeat these ne'er-do-wellers? Icy Harvest. Okay. Die, I guess. Animal hypostasis emulation. Animal hypostasis emulation. Oh, because the hypostasis is an enemy. I remember. I remember now. Okay, so you're emulating the hypostasis. That is actually pretty cool. I honestly never... That never clicked with me. Get him, Globster. Yeah, there we go. Teamwork. Alright, I see wish completed. Crimson wish completes. Anyway. Quest in this direction. Oh, do I have to go over the mountain still? Or rather, around it? I have to go around, so let's go... 
Counterclockwise. Ah, uh, this way. Around the mountain. That's where I gotta go. So that's where I'm gonna go. That is the plan. Cook. Nah. Is there more stuff about the table? Nope. Nothing missing there. I don't need to cook things. No big deal. Ooh, excuse me. He's giving me the burps. They're not too bad, though. As Shrek would say, better out than in, as he always say. There's also still one of those other keys on this mountain somewhere. Like, there's definitely... There's more areas here that I just have yet to go to. just haven't found them yet. So many butterflies and things. Butterflies. Nothing up there except for uh, a little, little torch thing, which I can use to warm myself up. Here. Nice Guava, please don't turn around. Thank you for doing exactly what I told you to do this time. Not that you can hear me or comprehend any words that I say into my microphone, as they are not keybound. But thank you for nonetheless complying. Oh, there's actually... Hmm, there's someone up there, too. There's another one. Ever been up this way? There's another torch to light. Hey, look at that. And from here, I can just, like... I can use my... You know, what do you call it? My glider to glide to the quest area. Anything special up here? No. No, no, not down the mountain. And is there more up there? I wonder. This seems breakable. Is it breakable? It looks breakable. A couple of rocks. No. What's at the top? Nothing! Yay! Bear Peaks! Alrighty then. Moving on with my life. <laughs> oh, well. Oh, I see a chilled boar down there, though. Attempting to look around as well. Kill the boar! Okay, maybe I should melt it first. Then kill the boar! Chilled meat. I just need one more of them. Oh, it's right over there. I saw a path in this direction. I want to check that out first. Perhaps it's the door! It's not the door. But maybe it is the door. It appears to be a dead end. But it's got star silver. That's nice, at least. Hey there. What are you doing? I don't like you. Oh, okay. So we're all fighting now. All right, then. Kill you. And kill you. But mostly kill you. the world. And where's the other one? Oh, is he dead already? That's convenient. Oh, I'm freezing. Look at that. What will I do? I'm freezing. Oh, I can use this. I can use this thing now. Uh, la 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 la. Go to inventory. And use this thing. Oh, I equipped it. Now what? Okay. What does that do, though? Oh, LB. Did it work? Nope. L, B, and B. There we go. Ah. Ah. I equipped that. Oh. That's what it means by equip. <laughs> Yet another thing right in front of my eyes that I somehow have missed. But now I notice. There's something else over here. There's a chest. Do something about it. Oh, that worked. I thought I could only break it with fire. I was incorrect. That's pretty cool. 
Perhaps there is something on top of this peak. Anything? Nothing on top of that peak over there. Nothing like that. This is a peak. There's another peak. Anything on top of this peak? Peaks, peaks, peaks. Peaks, peaks, peaks. And there's nothing on this peak. That's okay. And there doesn't seem to be anything on this one. Let's go to the quest area. Let's stop wasting my time and start doing things productively. Where's the fire? I see fire over there. Oh, come now. Complete the challenge by protecting the leyline monolith. All right, start. I will protect you. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> Die. Our opponents. Oh God. Come on, enough of that. Stop that. Stop. I must leave no stone unturned. I'm not hitting it, am I? No, I'm not. Good. I hope I wasn't hitting it. <laughs> that completely goes against what we're trying to do here. And then... Swirl it. Is there more? Of course there's more. Stop that. Aw, oh, you missed it. Leyline thing is coming down. Uh, not fun, not fun, not fun. Stop that. Get that fire. Get that fire, dude. Swirl it up. Stop that. And up that. Alright. And... Oh, there's more monsters. Where are you? <gasps> Stop hitting the monster. Stop that, jackrabbit. Asshole. And you've been overloaded. Wow, you just disappeared. Incredible. All right. Quest is done. That's all the dailies for the day. All righty. Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. Let me just quickly investigate what's up in this direction in case it's something that I have missed previously. I don't believe it is. This is not the door. This is the place that I thought was the door, but was, in fact, mistaken to be. Nonetheless, it was an area I had not been to before. So it did, it was pretty convenient. Now I want to head back to Mondstadt. So let's put that on the map. Mondstadt is back in this general direction. Oh, exploration progress in Dragonspine. 89%. I wonder what that means. Hmm. Can I just navigate? Adventurer's Guild, can I navigate? Uh, I just want to navigate to this point. No, stop, please. If I put this pin there, then... Pin, can I navigate? Navigate. There we go. I just want to navigate to the point. There we go. Thank you. I don't see a chest in that direction with those enemies. Which means I don't want to deal with them. So I won't. Although, there is a thing over here. An enemy. Perhaps guarding some secret lair. I have yet to find. Nah, it doesn't seem secret. It also doesn't seem like I've not been here before. But there is... Oh, there's a chest in here. Maybe I haven't. Or maybe chests respawn and I just... I'm just stupid. Which, honestly, I'd believe it either way. Stop. Enough of that. Now you're inflicted with fire. Overload. Yeah. Oh, didn't want to do that. And do it again. And slice you again. And 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 again. It's a weird thing on the ground. What is that blue thing? Was it a crafting table? Is that what a crafting table looks like in this game? It might actually be. Can I do anything about it? No. Alas. Alrighty then. Any marble blues in this area? Doesn't appear to be. 
I see no chests behind those baddies. So, uh, feels like a none of my business type deal. But I will get these star silvers, because I think they can be used for stuff. I just haven't figured out what yet. Or perhaps I have and I have just forgotten. Honestly, I wouldn't be surprised either way. Nah, I, I can't actually do that. Oh, please. Thank you. Oh, raw meat. Awesome. It was hibernating. And I killed it. I wonder if there's anything on top of this peak. Anything up on the peak? Ah, oh, campfire. That's something, all right. Better than nothing. All right. Very nice. Continuing my way down the mountain. I did want to come back down here because there is like an area. Is it? Is it here or might be elsewhere? Did I actually figure out what was down here? I don't recall exploring. I'm gonna take a look. I do not recall, but I could be wrong. Oh, who's... Who am I in contact with? Combat began. Alright, well, something's shooting at me. Alright, I have been down here before. I have. I don't believe there is anything left of interest. There's the scroll. Ragged records. Already did that. Feel the elemental energy burning. Follow the waterway north. I already did that, though. Maybe I already found the place. Maybe I didn't. It says follow the waterway north. There's a thing here. Butterfly. Just kidding. No touching the butterfly. Cryo butterfly. Hi there. Dead? Raw meat. Mmm, tasty. Follow the waterway north. Does this actually go north? It kind of does. I don't think I ever actually uh, followed the waterway. I'll try it. There's a thing over here, but with nothing of interest. Follow the waterway north. Hey! You look fun to play with. Something is down here. What is it? Start! It got warm. Is there anything in here behind the waterfall? Come on, anything behind the waterfall? No? Fine. Let's take care of you the only way I know how to. Quickly. Stop. Nope. Not a fan. Crystallize. And freeze. Girl, let's take care of you because you're going to know the hell out of me. Stop. It's kind of like that, except you're going to keep on doing that, which is annoying. Oh, stop. Oh, please. Oh, please, no. All right, you've been shaking off. Shake it off, shake it off. Oh, oh, oh. Use all of my tricks against this guy. Just, just completely, completely eviscerate you. I'm pulling out all the tricks, including this one, and that'll do it. Oh, I've never beaten this guy before. Another crimson agate. Very good. I suppose I'll just continue following the waterway. Because I guess I didn't do that before. Alrighty then. Follow the waterway north. Oh, there's something down. Oh. Perhaps it was good to follow the waterway north. I think the reason I didn't do that before was because I wanted to stay in Dragonspine. And I knew it would take me out of Dragonspine. Alright, well, I'm no longer in Dragonspine anymore. I should update that accordingly. Please don't hurt me. I do not mean you anymore. Yo, swirl time! Come on. Swirl. Come on. Do something. Leave it all to me. 
Swing, swing, swing. Perfect. That was pretty good. And do I have a key to unlock this? I don't know if I do. Do I? I do not. A shrine of the depths. Shrine of the geo depths. Come on, get him. Yeah. That's one of them. And the other one? Yeah. Nice. Nice job, Guoba. Very good. All right. Well, this is lo this is a nice little area. There's a chest over there. That's pretty cool. And I'm kind of heading towards Mondstadt, so this works. Let me change my title back to Windbloom. The Windbloom Boom Festival. There we go. There we, there we go. There we, there we go. Yeah. And another chest. And a waterway that does indeed proceed north. Can I just take it? Sweet. Alright. So now I'm here. Uh, was there like a secret area or something? They had like an out... Let's see. The scroll said, follow the waterway north. And then something about maybe a hideout or something? So this is the hideaway. This is the waterway. North. There's a chest down there. There's a chest right here. I'll take the stuff in that chest as well as put myself in harm's way as one tends to do. And we'll swirl. Swirl, swirl. Overloaded. If it works, it works. I ain't complaining. I'll catch up. Cool. Alrighty. Proceeding on. I'm very happy that I ascended my characters and leveled them up previously to going to, like, Dragonspine and whatnot. Now, instead of spending all of my time just fighting enemies, I can fight the enemies, move on, and do infinitely... an infinite number of other things. Infinitely other possible activities. Back in Dragonspine? Is it cold again? It is cold again. That looks unfamiliar, actually. What is over here? This looks surprisingly unfamiliar. Does it lead me into a cave somewhere? Big spiky cave! I think I've done this already. Alas, let us continue. And see. Hmm. Oh, have I been in here before? Oh dear. Have I not been? Is this new? Oh, yeah, no, I've, I've been here before because that's the big opening in the ceiling. Yep. Yes, I have been here before. And you're already up, right? Yep. That's already glowing. Been there, done that. Hi there, Slimes. Nah, I'm not gonna worry about you. It looked similar to what I had done before. Or it looked dissimilar to what I had done before. Which is why I checked it out. We shall see. We shall see indeed. Follow the waterway north. Oh, what is this over here? Oh. Oh, this requires something that I have not done before. Hey, guys. Um, hey. Yeah, you look like you're having a good time. Hey, hey. Let's, uh, let's just take out your shields. Both of you. Maybe one after the other. Please don't do that. Whatever comes first. Yep. Take out your shield. Electro charge. Oh, I've been doubled. Oh, what do I do about it now? 
Now I'm defenseless. What will I do? Cry. Probably. Cry a little harder. Alright, you're dead. And you will soon be dead. Just stop bubbling me! I like bubbles, but only when they're poppable. Stop that. Yes. Yeah. Drown in it. Drown in it, bubble man. Do, 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 do. Yeah. Not technically in Dragon Spine anymore, because I'm not cold. Alrighty then. That happened. Now I need a piece of... Look at that. Crimson Agate to break that marble ice. Scarlet Quartz. Excuse me. Scarlet Quartz is the small one, and Crimson Agate is the bigger one. What's in there? Oh, another thing. So, do I... Oh, I see. Perhaps I have to stand on them in a particular order. That's one. Okay. Perhaps not that one. And then this one? No? Oh, okay. Do I have to get them all up at once? Is there a particular order? C can I put things on them? If I step off of it, something... Hmm. Is there a... Maybe there's a particular order. And now that I've done that... Do I hop? Oh, no. Do I have to hop from one to the other, maybe? No? Okay. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, so- okay. That stuck around for a little bit. Interesting. But I can't use more than those at once. And then that glows up. But then it goes away. Oh, yo! Things are opening up on the, the runes. Okay. Now that's gone. What if I do this one? Rune opens up. And then... Okay. Not that one. Puzzle time! I bet there's a particular order. That's another one. Now which one? Oh, alright. Uh, I wish I could get warm again. No, okay, that one wasn't right. Here, just uh... Guoba, please. Guoba, please. Go Guoba. 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 Thank you. No, 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 no. Okay. So that did something. This one. Got to stand on it for a prolonged period of time. There's one. There's another rune. Need another rune. Then do I do... Or maybe I have to make a certain shape. It wasn't that one. What about this one? Nope, it appears not. This one. And then this one. And then that one. Perhaps this one. Nope, guess not. Is the shape on there? I wonder if the shape on the walls has something to do with it. Oh, maybe I have to do like symbols. Because they are all the same symbol.
And there's also a symbol there and there. Oh, excuse me. So maybe it's this one as well? No? Okay. Does anything happen if I do them one at a time? Oh, that's one. Is this one on as well? Oh, that's a different symbol entirely. Okay, I see. There's one. This is also the same symbol. Yep. Okay. I'm grasping it. So that was four of the same. Is there another one? Nope, not that one. Hmm. Okay. What about... Well, now I've got those activated. What comes next? Okay. Now I'll do that. And this one is also the same symbol, I believe. Or not? Perhaps this one over here instead. Yep. And then this one? And then finally this one. No. Am I missing one? There's the one, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Is there another tablet somewhere that I'm not aware of? Hmm, I thought it dawned upon me. Well, that might have been it. That one doesn't seem to want to light up. Or maybe it's, it's not the wrong one, is it? That's a one, two, three, four, and five. Mm -hmm. And that's one, two, three. Is it is it this one? Oh, that was the other one. Okay. Nice. What else is in here? Cool. Crimson Agate. Guide the resistance. Cool. That was a tough puzzle. That was a good one. That was a good puzzle. Um how did I not notice that before? All right, I'm going to take a quick check up in this route. Break this ice here. Cryo crystal butterfly, crystal fly, cryo crystal fly. Just to see what else I can find, if I find anything. And then I will continue following the waterway north, continuing on with the Wind Moon Festival. And all the things that I promised myself I would do. And this just kind of leads me back to this area over here, which isn't really helpful. Is it? No, really is not. Continuing to follow the waterway north. Back to over there. Perhaps without being too hasty, as I will run out of stamina and die. And fall to my doom! Anywho's, so I need to follow the waterway north. Well, now I'm at the waterway, and I am indeed proceeding north. Can I see anything along the banks? There is an island in the middle, so if I keep heading north, I am to assume perhaps I will find what I'm looking for. There are a couple of things down here that I have yet to explore, so let's give it a shot. Saltere, I believe this place was called. How are you still sleeping over there? Incredible. Incredible. 
Oh, and now you're awake. Chest unlocked. All right, did that. Oh, there is something. High in the sky, over the water. Nah, it's just Jokelius. Just, just keep on, keep on swimming. Just keep on swimming. Gotcha. Everybody, fire! No, please, please, no. Oh god. Oh, stop that. Y'all aren't being very cash money right now. Okay. If I if I slam you into the water, what happens? Into the water. No? Okay. Well, you're actually dead now, so that's pretty cool. Alright, and so is everybody else. And everything is electrified. That's always nice. Oh, and there's a, um, a waypoint over here. Cool. Whatever this is. Cool. Ta-da! Teleport waypoints! What is this? A chest? Oh, hi there. Hey, how you doing, pal? How you doing? Hey, good to see you. Always a pleasure. Always a pleasure, Catherine. Oh, you're up in the sky. See, that's that's my least favorite place to find you. Anything you'd like me to do about that? All right, that's fine then, I guess. Fire, 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 swirl, fire, fire, swirl. No, don't go away. Oh, come back. Truly unfortunate. Never a more unfortunate event I've seen in my life. As a maid would. Oh, stop. Just, just let it happen. Let it happen. Stay on the ground. Stay on the ground. Yes. Mm. It says as it dies. Mm. No, I'm not kill me. Now I'm dead. What will I do? Cry. Cries harder. Anything over here? Nope. Time to continue following the waterway north. Do 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 do. Hmm. And what does this button do? Blow up exploding barrels. Cool. Seems like a job for sucrose. Yes. Nice. Okay. Uh, and another one. Absorption test. Again! Failed! What do you mean? Oh, but I but I did the barrels. Oh, I'll just do it again then. It's fine, just fine, it's fine. Just just keep on going. Yay! A little beaten, a little scarred, but Sucrose is the one for the job. Now there's something over there, so I'm gonna swim over. If I swim over carefully enough, I will not die. Perhaps this is Sealed Man's secret cave. Potentially. One won't know unless we try. Ugh. Pleasant and slow days thus far. I'm gonna have soup for lunch at some point. Hopefully the soup is dethought already. Oh my, would you look at that. 
That seems fun. Well then, what does this say? Ancient steel. Salt steals the ruin. Seals the ruin within. None uninvited may enter in. But I thought perhaps I was uninvited. I was invited. I followed the waterway north as I was instructed to do so. No. Maybe there's something I gotta do. Uh, this might be story quest stuff. Oh well. Noted. Noted, and I suppose I'll just move on. Is that area unlocked to me now, or am I just gonna be... No, it appears that I can go that way. Oh, I wasn't able to do it over there. I see, I see. Well, I followed the waterway north, and I have a feeling that's the place to be. Oh well. Uh, to Mondstadt. But first, to go for a little swim. Oh, okay. There's another, um... Shrine of whatever thing up there. But I have no keys. How to unlock door if I do not have key? I don't know. I am no locksmith, neither is Sucrose. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. <laughs> Hello, everybody. <laughs> Causing trouble? <laughs> Let's fix that. With the power of dance. But I cannot dance. Swirl. Swirl. Swirl, swirl, swirl. Swirl, swirl, swirl. Everybody swirl. Everybody do the swirl. Yeah, just, just take care of it. Oh, where'd you go? 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 Where did you go? Oh, you are right back where I thought you were. Goodness gracious. Now that your shield is gone, I can attack your supple and small body. I like how my cable keeps whacking the table. Let's see. Route that over here. Maybe that's better. I'm still making funny sounds. No. Hmm. Guess, uh, just gonna keep it that way. Okay. Oh. Continuing north towards Mondstadt. Do I think I could play this game on the PC with a controller, or would it be worth it? I think it's very worth it, and I think it's very doable. If not, the way to play, in case that answers your question. For those without eyes in the audience, that sounds so insulting. This is this is the controller I use. I'm actually not using a keyboard. <laughs> I think it's totally worth it, yeah. Pr frankly, I much more enjoy the controller play than a... Well, let's see, actually, so I've played this game both on PC with a controller and with a keyboard... I prefer it with the controller, and I also play it on mobile as well. <laughs> I'm happy to uh, provide a good answer. Perfect. Sometimes moments like that cannot be too perfect. <laughs> Should I do it with controller? I don't know. Should you? This is why I love live television. Oh, trying to chop, pop these bubbles. Oh, chest in the corner? Sweet. Chest in the corner. Let's kill off these tiny little slimes. I 
I feel like for games like these, controllers are very, very convenient. Versus, for example, a game like Soul Worker, if there was controller support, I don't think I would opt for it because there are so many different abilities that you can map. It'd be crazy. Couldn't have described it better myself. I then realized afterwards, like, oh, what if, the, what if they're not actually looking at the stream, in which case perhaps I should narrate that. Narration is key for those in the audience who don't have eyes, which I'm sure there's may at least one of you, maybe, or perhaps not without eyes. That sounds so insulting. For those without eyes in the audience, <laughs> plebeians, <laughs> here's a narration. Nah, just kidding. Oh, wait, I was supposed to, uh, uh balloons. Where the balloons go? Uh, there they are. Lest I forget. And I need Amber for that. Or Venti. You know what? Let's build the Venti team. While I'm at it, so I don't have to use Amber ever again. Let's make a new team. Uh, not with you all. Uh, let's see. Zhongling for DPS. Jin Yan, because why not? Um, and let's do Venti. And Sucrose. The steam. I can do it. I don't think it's very pay to win. I haven't spent a single dime on this. Let's see. If you're the kind of person who wants to more or less obsess over getting like all the characters and stuff like that, then yeah, you might have to spend some money on it. Honestly, I, I really like this game. I think it's incredibly relaxing. I wouldn't say it's very pay to win, at least with my play style. Because mine is just, you know, I roll the dice or rather I roll the gotcha machine, and whatever I get, I kind of make my team around what I've got. So, for context purposes, I haven't yet spent a single dime on this game, nor on any merchandise, and it's been totally free for me so far, and I've gotten hours of enjoyment out of this, so I totally recommend it. Did I actually open that chest? I think I did. Now I've got Venti, who we've been told is one of the most broken characters in the game. Yes, it is multiplayer. You have to get to a certain level first. You have to get to Adventure Rank 16, I believe, and then Co-op Mode becomes available to you. The caveat of that is, on Co-op Mode, you can't, like, do story quests or anything. One of the reasons why... A couple of times people have tried to join my world on stream. I don't know if it's anybody watching or if they just kind of go through the list and whatnot. I don't think it's available right now. No, it is available right now. Um, but you can't do story quests on co-op mode, and I tend to do a lot of story quests. Um, so, like, I'm always afraid, like, oh, if somebody joins the world, and they come along, and they're like, oh, let's hang for a little bit, and I'm like, well, I have to do other things. I don't want to have to, like, kick them out of my party to do the multiplayer quest. I just feel like it's rude, so I usually just don't, just don't do it. Unless somebody specifically requests... I've played multiplayer with a couple of my friends before. It's fun. It's a good time. Except everybody is always... I'm always woefully underleveled compared to everybody else. But honestly, sometimes that's that's just the fun. Can't switch characters? Lies. Anyway, it was nice. Playing with Venti was pretty good. But yes, there is a co-op mode, and you can play together. On co-op mode, you have one character that you choose. And then you have your um, multiplayer characters, like whoever's playing with you. So I played, I think I had, I was on a game with two other people. And I had my character that I played, and they played their two characters. But you couldn't switch to other characters like you can now. Like I have a party of four, you can switch between them freely. Um, on multiplayer mode, you can't really do that. First character is in like the main character, the traveler character. Yeah, they're pretty good. One of their, I do like their ability to the, whoops, to the point where as you progress later on in the game, you can actually change what their element is. And I've been more or less sticking with the, the geo element, because the traveler with the geo element has a particular ability that I think is very convenient to use in certain parkouring situations. It makes it very convenient. I think my favorite character of the game is Sucrose, that I just switched to. Because one of the elemental abilities that you can use is Swirl. Where if the enemy is already afflicted with some sort of elemental trait, Swirl, I think, affects 
almost all of them. And it has a particular effect. My favorite combination is Animo, which Sucrose and Venti. The Wind one. And Fire. It works very well for most combat maneuvers that I can do. Which works out pretty well. I do like... I do like Noelle, though. Noelle has the ability where if you put up her shields, which is her, in my case, RT ability, right trigger ability, and you start hitting enemies, you can actually heal your teammates, which is incredibly convenient to have. Let's get this... Oh, where's the teleport waypoint? Is it below me? It's below me. Oh, it's down in the... Hello there. I see that there is a teleport waypoint down here. Right down there. Let's push down. Don't die. Cool. Can I? Nope. What if I fire it? Yeah, it worked. Here we go. Plus, honestly, some people would complain about the whole gotcha nature of this game. Like, you need to roll a bunch to get the characters that you want. But honestly, I think... I, I like it. It doesn't really... It's not like... Let's see. I like games where you have to... To earn the characters. As opposed to just randomly getting them if you can. But I mean, it, it just offers a different experience to it. Noelle is a name from Black Clover. Is it a character from the anime Black Clover? No, it's just another character from this game. I have a, actually haven't yet had the pleasure to watch Black Clover. I want to, though. I just haven't yet. I plan to eventually. That's one of those longer animes that's on my list to watch. But no, this is a different Noelle. This Noelle is a maid. Unless the Noelle from Black Clover is also a maid. It'd be cool if they were like crossovers. Like, uh, I know another game that this company makes, Mihoyo Game, creates a game called Honkai Impact, and they're actually going through an event. I don't think it's an event right now. I think it was the previous event where they actually did Honkai Impact X Neon Genesis Evangelion, which is another anime which everyone should watch. Or perhaps not watch, depending on the person. But so they did that crossover... So, being that that company did the crossover with their other game, I wouldn't be surprised to think that perhaps they might do a crossover with Genshin Impact as well. So, I don't think it's totally out there. It might happen. Wizard Witch. All right. She were a really good spell. Sweet. Does Black Clover have a game as well? If, they, if there's a game as well for Black Clover, I'm not familiar with it. I'm just only familiar with the anime. And only slightly familiar, as I said mentioned previously, I have not watched it, but I plan to. I wouldn't be surprised if Black Clover has a game, honestly. Dihua Marsh. Well, I need to go north, so I'm gonna go north. Go check. Oh, thank you. Thank you for checking for me. I think... Black Clover strikes me as one of those animes that probably does have, like, a game or two. Kind of like, I think Soul Worker has a game or two. Um, I don't know if, I don't think even Gillian has a game or two. But, like, there are games that, or let's see, I think Fairy Tale, Fairy Tale has a game or two. But I don't know if it's essential to the plot of the story. Like, I don't know if it's just in addition to the plot of the story that you would get. And the other one... Oh, is there a boss over here that I can fight? Ooh. I want to fight boss. I want to fight boss. I'm going to fight boss. Let's see. Black Clover Quartet Knights. Cool. Challenge the Oceanid. Yeah, let's do it. Rodea of Loch. Hi there. Oh. Upon the waters of Chinsa. Okay. Covered I have yes, I have trespassed. Land. Don't hurt me. Or do hurt me. I guess that's that's waters. your job. In water illusions land. have joined the battle. Water, your punishment. That's pretty freaky. Hey there. I've crossed into your domain, it seems. Uh I I'd like to Oh, these are high level. I don't think Venti is prepared for this. Let's play. Let's play. Yeah, swirl. Swirl ability. Like, $50 for that game? Oh, no. 
I'd have to I'd have to be convinced to buy it. All right, this ain't working with Venti. Back to uh, Xiangling. Can you come to the ground, please? Oh, is Venti dead? Oh my God, Venti died. Oh my God. This is not working. Uh. Well then. These are powerful, powerful monsters. I haven't even had the chance to fight the actual enemy yet. Wow. Um. Swim away. Swim away. Please don't hurt me. No, stop. Oh, you've drowned me. Oh, okay. I can continue swimming where I left off. That's incredible. I'm gonna run away. And, uh... <laughs> that wasn't very good. I'm gonna try switching parties to my prepared party. Okay, I don't think I'm in the battle anymore. Party setup. Go back to Noel. The Noel party. Is everybody still dead? Zhongling is still dead. That's fine. Do that. And, uh... Yeah. We'll revive you. Uh, invigorating pizza to Zhongling. Yes. Eat another one. Yes! Delicious northern apple stew. Very good. Alright, well, uh... Let's try that again. Or perhaps a little better this time. I'm never really equipped to fight enemies that are in the air. Never really equipped for that. Yeah. If it's a game that I'm, like, hyped up about, I will absolutely spend money on it. Upwards of 50 bucks. But I gotta be either super hyped for it or have a reason. From our homeland, Can I hit you? A fool who trespasses upon the waters of uh, I'm a fool. Coveting the shapes of the living. Pure water. And take on many forms. Water illusion. Oh, I'm wet. Duh. Maybe I don't want that. Oh, sweet. There's squirrels this time. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. If I just whack you like this, can I can I get rid of you? Water, 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 water. As a good night should. I don't know if this is helping. Let's electrify. Uh, I said electrify. Oh, uh, water shield? Is its ability to take any shape. This is correct. Oh, I see. I can fight the illusions, and it actually deals an uh damage. Are they ducks? Oh my god, the little ducks! That's so cute. Just a scratch. Here, get the fire. Vaporize. Oh, stop. Without solid ground, terrestrial creatures become simply helpless. This is true. Some of the platforms are starting to sink. Oh. That's fun, I guess. Hmm. Alrighty, then. Don't think that you'll get it. Weird animation. It classifies itself as a first-person shooter. It looks more like a game you're playing, but with the 4v4 fight mode where you fight with the characters. Is that the Black Clover game that you were mentioning? Honestly, I haven't really been into shooters recently. One of my buds actually reached out to me again. And was like, hey, you know, what kind of games are you playing? I've been playing a lot of shooters. I'm like, I just haven't been into them. I used to play, like, Halo and stuff. And, oh, goodness, I need heals. I need heals. I shall wait. Nope, stop. Don't do that. I wait for the heals. But, like, I used to play, like, Halo and stuff like that. But I just haven't really been into it. I mean, I played Fortnite recently. That was pretty fun. That's considered a shooter. I liked it. Didn't play it a lot. But, uh, you know. Alright, I want to get rid of this bird. This bird is annoying me. Oh my god, you were killing my character. Wow, I just noticed. You were doing a ton of damage to me. Delicious northern apple stew for anybody who wants it. Oh, you know what? Actually, I have items to resist water damage, don't I? Increase all hydro res. Yep, let's do that. Never into FPS. Open world games and adventure games? Yeah, I, I love those. Open world, like, I fell in love with Skyrim when I first started playing it. Amazing. I fell in love with Breath of the Wild. Amazing. Absolutely loved it. Let's try this. Get rid of this bird. But I absolutely love those games. Oh, that did a ton of damage. Water? Um, big bubble? Okay. More water illusions. Oh, don't. That's wet. Oh, and now the birdies. I need to use your... Do that, and put some fire out there, and put some of that. This is all I can do to help. Oh god, you're 
doing. I must look quick. Let's see what happens. Oh, it worked. I got it. Uh, you gotta take more things down. More sinking platforms. This boss ain't too bad with the correct party. Beta's not feeling so happy though. All right, more sinking platform. That's okay. Oh, and then there's you. Are you actually gonna fight me for real, Jesus? Yes, I believe you've mentioned that before. Uh, I don't like that bird. The bird hurts. The bird hurts. The bird hurts me greatly. All right, just continue. C consider burbs. Electro charge. Get some of that in there. Do some DPS if I can. Don't fall off the platform. Don't. Nah. Don't do that. All right, that's fine, I guess. Try not to. Try not to die. If I can. Sucrus is a weak one. I jinxed myself. <laughs> I said it was not hard, and then, well, it got me. You're darn right. I mean, I suppose it's okay. It wasn't challenging before, and by saying it's not a challenge, now the challenge is here, and I love a good challenge. Let's do that. And then switch to Noel so I can actually get some heals. All right. As long as rain falls and rivers flow. Oh, I, I did it. Oh, I did it. Cool. Yeah, I'll claim that. All right. It was just the final stretch of it all. Character XP, Adventure XP, Competitive XP, Mora, Cleansing Heart, Berserker's Road, Tiara of Torrents, Varunanda, Varunada's Lazarite, Adventurous Tailfeather, and the like. Pretty cool. I wonder if... I wonder whose character this uses for Ascension. Maybe maybe Barbara, because Barbara's a water. Nice job. Well, I thank you. I curtsy to you. If you ever want to trade tactics, I'm... Where's Barbara? What's your Ascension materials? Uh, yeah, okay, that's exactly what I need for her Ascension materials, so I should come back for this boss eventually. I want to level up Venti because I want to be able to use him. And I haven't yet. That's Max. There we go. And you've been leveled up. Uh, and then that. There we go. What's your ascension materials like? I can ascend Venti. Pretty cool. But what about the characters that I'm already using? Right? So, Sucrose, can I ascend you? I can. So I will ascend you first. Because I love Sucrose. And let's see. Zhongling has also already been ascended. Uh, your talents, I think, can be leveled up too. Let's level you up with those materials. Absolutely. What about this one? Level up. Absolutely. This one level up. I don't have enough Whopper Flower Nectar. All right. Uh, can I upgrade any more of Zhongling's talents? They're already upgraded. Uh, can I ascend you, Beto? Can I ascend you? If you ever want to trade nope, tactics, not yet. Always... What about you, Noel? Can I send you? Not quite yet. How do you set up controller? So you can go... Here, I'll walk you through it. You can go to your settings. And under controls, you can change your controller type to controller or keyboard. Um, it might be a little glitchy. I know when I first changed it, it kept going back to keyboard mode. And another thing is too... A and B are going to be reversed. And so if you go into controller setup, you can actually change the system to be confirm cancel A and B or B and A. And it works out pretty well that way. If you're in, if it works for you, like you're okay with B being confirm or A being not, then you don't have to change it. But I personally like A being confirm and B being cancel. But you can change them in the settings menu, which is off to the left. I hope that I was able to be of assistance. Cool. Onward to Mondstadt. Actually, can I go up to those areas over there? I cannot go that way, so I must proceed to the east. Must have proceed to the east. So I shall do that. Someone needs assistance. I'll make my way to Mondstadt. And then after, after I do that... 
probably break for a bit, grab myself some lunch. Eat a cheese sandwich and some soup. That'll be nice. Sent you green tea? Not as bad as I remember it to be. I remember it being not very good, but it's actually not too bad. It kind of mellows out the longer it sits. I don't like that. Goody, good, good. At the very least, I'd say it leaves a very pleasant aftertaste. I need some more... Need some more stamina. There we go. Continue up the mountain. And hopefully not fall, as these surfaces don't really seem climbable. Okay, I just got an up here. Oh, okay. Not too bad. And let's continue up the... No! What are you doing? Stop! Don't fall! <laughs> Jeez. No, well, don't scare me like that. There we go. And slowly but surely make my way up to the top. I will, I will, I will. There we go. Another boss bites the dust. Thanks for the help. You're very welcome. I am here to assist as best as I can. If I may assist, merely call. I like helping people out. One of the things that I always wanted to do with my life, no matter what I do in the future, whatever career it may be, is I just want to help people. I want to make people smile some way. When I was going through engineering uh, school, and I still technically am, but when employers would ask, like, oh, you know, why did you choose to be, why did you choose this area of expertise? And I'd be like, well, I really like computers, so computers is something that I want to dedicate my life to because I think they're freaking awesome. But, the, but also, like, I would apply for <clears throat> positions in consumer electronics, which are things like whoever invented your remote control or whoever invented your controller or your video game devices, your consoles. Like, I want to be able to be in that type of field because it sure as hell made me happy when I would use them. Like, the convenience of, be the convenience of being able to, like, just click the button on a remote control is, like, it's super convenient. And people kind of take it for granted. But those are the types of inventions or those are the types of electronics that I'd love to be able to continue making in the future for the people who I don't mind if you take advantage of whatever I make for you. So long as you use it, it improves your life in some way, shape, or form. Like, if it improves your life, I'm totally happy that you're using it. I don't think I have really much to show for that as of now, but, you know, you go through school first, increase my skills... And now that I have those skills and continue to learn them in the future, hopefully I'll be able to make something that affects people's lives positively one day. That's the goal. Or make somebody smile or make somebody laugh. Naturally, I'm not inventing anything of consequence here streaming on the internet. But, um... Yeah, at least I'm making people smile. Or at least I hope I am. That's the goal. They say that laughter is the best medicine, and I'm inclined to agree. Oh, kill these enemies. Stop. Stop, because it's raining and it's wet. Not fun. Stop! Oh my god! Oh my god, stop! There we go. Oh, please. Oh, please. Please. Thank you. Clear the main road of any monsters and obstacles. Really? Oh? Is this a mission I have to do? Was this a mission I had to do? Really? No, I don't think so. Onwards to monster. Is my heater on? My heater's not on. I just got incredibly warm for a second. Weird. Maybe I need more water. I don't know why, but I just got, like, incredibly warm for the past couple minutes. I'm starting to sweat, too. Like, I don't know what's going on. I don't think it's warm in here. I don't have my heater on. I definitely turned it off. Maybe I should take off my, uh, my second layer. Take off the undershirt. Switch that out on break. Or perhaps I'm just hungry. 
probably just hungry. But I must make it to Mondstadt. And once I make it to Mondstadt, I will have soup and a sandwich. That'll be nice. No meat, though. There's no meat here, though. Or at least no cold cuts. There is meat, but there are no cold cuts, which is usually my... Uh... My meat of choice. Oh, please make it to the top! Please... Oh, no. Oh, well. I fell. That's okay. That's A-OK. -okay. Up to the top. To the top now. Yeah. Alrighty then. Cool, made it there. Uh, avoid the lightning if possible. If that is at all possible. Do do do. I don't think I have any animunculus. I definitely don't. But I will take the heals. Did I heal? Did I did I not heal? I need heal. Oh come on. You got it. Statue of a seven. Give me your blessing. And hopefully I'm healed. Yay! Heals time. Someone needs assistance. Do that. Vaporize. Do that. And kill you all. That worked incredibly well. Perfect. Let's see. What else do we got? Making my way to Mondstadt in the rain. Gliding down these valleys. La 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 And continuing on. I must be hungry because I'm like fantasizing about my sandwich and the soup. I'm like thinking in my head like, oh, I can't wait to just eat that soup. Really slurp that soup. Put it in the microwave, nice and warm. My sandwich will probably be... Let's see. Well, there are no cold cuts. It will have cheese on them. It will have cheese on it. Let me plan out my sandwich. We'll have Swiss cheese, because that's the only cheese I have. Maybe put it in the toaster oven a little bit. Get that cheese all melty and gooey. Maybe a little bit of butter on the toast. Oh, that'd be nice. What else? There might be some celery in the fridge. I got some mayo. Yeah, you know what? Mayo. Mayo, a little bit of cheese so it's not that dry. That'll be nice. The soup, I have two soup options. One is a, a green soup with a bunch of veggies in it. Yeah. Lock camera on the character or when fighting. I don't know. If there is a way, I have yet to discover it myself. There might be a lock button. What was I thinking? Um, no, that was Soul Worker where we mentioned the... Um, the locking on the character. I don't think there's a way. There might be. I, I might consult the Google for that one. Daily rewards. Gotcha. Let's also do the adventure rank. Let's get Chung Yun back from Expedition. It's okay. I don't really use... I need this stuff from Expeditions right now. And adventure rank rewards. Oh, sweet. Oh, I think... Were those the ascension materials I needed for Noel? Maybe. Oh, let's do that real quick. And then I will break for sandwich. So many things to do. Can I? Oh, okay. I need the Revara Funda things. I don't yet have those. That must be the next level. Okay. I will break. I will break. Eat sandwich. We'll be back in a little bit. Probably get some more tea and fill up some water. Please enjoy these parrots.
And I'm back from my lunch journey. Very pleasant. Very pleasant lunch. The soup had corn in it. Pepper soup. It was good. My sandwich was Swiss cheese and celery. With some ranch and mayo. I love it. Also got a call from my landlord, too. Apparently he stopped by for a little bit. So I'll have to take another break. In a little bit. When he comes a-knocking. Let's see. Oh, got my headphones on the wrong way. There we go. Now it looks better. Let's see. Let's do more quests for the event. Being that I'm here, I should be doing that. Festive challenges. So, uh, not that one. It's the... Is it the anecdotes? Yes. Go to quest. Those hard-to-reach places. Uh, yes. Let's do that one. Knight of Favonius Aramis wants something earlier. We'll do that. And it's up there. Alright. Just finishing off the rest of my sandwich. Like two more bites. Good sandwich complete. I think perhaps I was just hungry, which is why I was getting so hot. But I took off my under layer anyway. And now it's just the flamingo shirt. Small amount of effort to clear withered flowers out. But while I can handle the flowers and leaves in the plaza itself, there's not much I can do about the ones that get onto roofs and city walls. Not with these knees of mine. I can do it. I'll, I'll just do it for you. The withered flowers are obvious. See them from the roof. <laughs> roof of where? Roof of over here, I suppose. What's up, six-fingered Jose? Do you actually have six fingers, or is that just what they call you? Clear the piles of floral debris off of the rooftop. Is it this rooftop? He probably mentioned which rooftop, but I wasn't paying attention. It's definitely not this rooftop. It's definitely a different rooftop. rooftop. Come on, up we go. There we go. I remember there being like really big chests up here. Really good ones. All right, do I have, I have to go this way? Am I going? Am I going out of Mondstadt? Which rooftop, I ask? Oh, this rooftop. Oh, I see. Let's clear them. And how should I clear them? Should I clear them with fire? Set the roof on fire. That'll work. Can I electrify them too? Nah, it seems fire is the way to go. <laughs> fire is the way to go. Nope, wrong way. Nope, C continue. You've got the right idea, Guoba. You've got the spirit, just not the right, not in the right direction. <laughs> Stop. This way. Come on. There we go. Now the roof's on fire. Oh, next rooftop. Oh, I, I see that this is just a thing now. Well, yes, if your weak knees couldn't handle getting on top of the roof, I completely understand. Huh? 
It's a good thing that I'm young and spry and can climb the roofs for you. And, of course, just fly between buildings. It's always a plus. That's the wrong roof. Oh, uh, which roof? That roof. Okay, you got that one. That's cool. And also do this one, please. Yes, thank you. And, I don't know. Oh, sweet, and that one too. Nice. Perfect, and that's all of them, I think. On this one, at least. On this particular roof. And another roof. Cool. More roof hopping. Cool, cool. Meow. I'm sorry, is there a... Keep an eye out, we're cleaning up. Is there a cat in here somewhere? Am I just gonna set the cat on fire? Oh god! I don't wanna set the cat on fire! Or do I? Do I show any mercy? To the feline? That one's taking damage. That was weird. <laughs> that particular pile took damage. Kitty? Kitten? Kitten in that pile? It's everything spick. Didn't find the cat. Aw. Uh, kitty cat? Where are you, kitty cat? Are you up here? No? Alright. Hi there, cat. Are you okay? Huh. Meow, meow. <laughs> meow, meow, meow? Meow. All right. <laughs> Hate to break it to you, but I can't understand it. It can't understand you. Maybe. Back to Aramis. Hey, dude. Uh, I found this cat. And I think it's yours. That's not my cat. Well, it is now. You would have found it if you were the one cleaning the roofs. And naturally, you wouldn't just leave the cat there to die. Or would you? I consider the idea of getting a cat. My fiancé doesn't like cats, though. So naturally, we would opt for a dog instead. But this apartment doesn't allow pets. I tried double-checking through our lease to see if there was anything about pets, and no, there isn't. No, no pets. No pets. That's okay. We got plenty of dogs and cats at my parents' house in case I miss them. My parents' house, we have three dogs. Mickey, Morgan, and Danica. And we've got two cats. N uh, excuse me. Two cats, Da Vinci and Providence. My brother has one of the house cats as well. His name is Nice. The cat, that is. All right, Aramis, Aramis, and Margaret. I don't think I've seen it. All right. <laughs> that little darling really loves flowers. Are you looking for a cat that I almost set on fire? Meow, meow. <gasps> Butterfly! Thank you for finding Butterfly! Incredible! Oh, not this again. Yeah, kitty cat. Flying around. Running on the rooftops. Doing cat things. They're attracted to flowers. <laughs> Thank you for giving me things. Do I get tickets? <gasps> no tickets, but Primo Gems. Yeah, Primo Gems. New quest. Margaret, where are you, Margaret? Where are you, Margaret? Come here there, Margaret. Talk to me. Talk to me, Margaret. Tell me the deets. What do you got for me? Give me all the sick, juicy gossip of the uh, Mondstadt. What? Nimrod did what? He drank himself comatose again? <sighs> What a Nimrod.
I should wonder what type of gossip happens in Mondstadt. Master Jeans. I mean, there probably isn't a lot of gossip. I mean, at the first sign of trouble, people thought Master Jean was, like, dead and in the ground. If they would have gotten all their gossiping out already, perhaps the, uh, the response wouldn't have been as crazy. New special beverage. Fun in the city. You want some food and drink? Drunk very quickly. If all they drink is alcohol, they'd be liable to get pulled aside by the knights. Oh, goodness. That'll ruin the mood. If you reek of alcohol. Some people enjoy hazy, drunken atmosphere. Uh, but what about you, Margaret? What do you enjoy? A refreshing non-alcoholic drink, milk-based and filled with the flavor of the wind. Like mint, perhaps? Is that minty enough? I think we can use two special editions, dandelions and windwheel asters. Be here all day if I'm the only one collecting them, so... I, I can get you... I, I can get both. What do you want? I'll collect dandelion seeds, and I'll do the asters. All right, I collected your asters. Is that it? Go to Windrise and collect three wind... Really? Gotta go all the way out there? Um, all righty then. I guess I'll do that. Well, in that case, perhaps I should have chose the dandelions because they're literally right out front. Well, that's annoying. Oh, well. Onward and outward. Hey, yo, Timmy. How you doing, Timmy? Bye, Timmy. Timmy's that kind of kid who just sits on the bridge all day doing absolutely nothing. Just standing there watching the pigeons. Literally, 24 hours a day. Ah, such is the life of an NPC. You have one job, and you don't need to do anything. Oh, and now I need to talk to Lynn? Oh, oh okay. Yeah, and you don't need to do anything except stand there and wait for the player to talk to you. Uh, you. Hi, Lynn. What are you doing here, Traveler? I'm out looking for Sweet Flower, but not having much luck so far. Could you help me out? I only need one Sweet Flower. Sure. Great, I'll keep looking around here in the meantime. When you're done, come and see me. Here. He he take it. Huh. Perfect! This is for you! What'd I get? Alright. That's cool. Uh, did I get my wind wheel esters? Did I do it? Or did it change me to a different quest? Uh, Windbrew. Yeah. What the heck? You switched the quest on me. Dastardly. Kill the f thing. Nope. No meat. Die. I did it. There's a lot of raw meat from that little one. Who's fighting me? Nobody. Why the combat music if there's nothing here? Oh, hello. Hey, look, something here. I jinxed it again. Nice. Man, I hope somebody doesn't drop $20 on my desk. Nah, I didn't jinx it. Jinxing doesn't work that way. Here, I'll burn the ground. Oh, rather fine red wheel aster. Rather fine wind wheel aster. Ah, oh, they're specific. These ones are rather fine. Some fine... You've got a nice, fine aster there, if I do say so myself. <laughs> Sir, please don't harass me. Swirl. Swirl. Big fire. Big fire, go boom! Big fire, go boom. Thank you. Is this another rather fine one? Nah, it's just a regular one. This one's okay.
There we go. And then back to the monster. I'll catch up. Where's the bridge again? Where, uh, where's mon? Oh, it seems that I've lost my way. If I go north, right? Or if I just open up the map, like I should be doing. Oh, I'm going the exact opposite direction. Incredible. Follow the path the other way. Ah, oh, yeah, there's Mondstadt. Ha! Nice. Minty, minty. The taste of the wind. Well, now I gotta wonder what the heck does a wind wheel ester taste like? I already know what a dandelion tastes like. Very, very bitter. At least the stem of it is. Then again, I don't know what the flower Someone of the dandelion tastes like. Someone I guess I'll have assistance. to try that once spring really comes into full bloom. Someone needs assistance. I'll catch up. Someone needs assistance. Someone needs assistance. Someone needs assistance. I need assistance. Somebody help me. Please send help. SOS. Timmy still standing on the bridge? Let's see. Oh, Timmy. Oh, I don't see Timmy. Oh. Has he finally found something else to do with his time? Look at that. He's not on the bridge. Hmm. About time somebody got that kid out of here. Hi there, Sage. I'm taking your, taking your dandelion seed. Thank you. My dandelion seed. My dandelion seed. They're probably useful for something. Let's talk to Margaret. Margaret. Oh, Margaret, where are you? Oh, okay. Hanging in an alleyway again? Seems so. You found the ingredients? I believe you have. Here, take them. There you go. Very fine, windmill asters. I wonder what flowers will achieve if we... Flavors. If we use them in our blend. Got all the ingredients. Let's blend the beverage. Am I interested in trying it out? Absolutely. Blending isn't complicated. You just need to follow the steps. Alright. You put it in the blending machine. We call it a blender. Oop. One moment. Landlord's here. I'll be back. Hold on.
And my landlord and the handyman have come and gone. Handleman will be back tomorrow to fix my curtain rod. Perfect. How do we blend a beverage? Well, I'm sure it's a very difficult and involved process. So let's start basically. Place a sweet flour inside before pouring the base alcohol we're using for this cocktail. And then of course we'll drizzle some milk in to lay the foundations for the clear sweet texture. Interesting, they were making a cocktail for this? Ooh, I'm curious now. Sweet flour and milk, okay, all right. Base alcohol, perhaps a rum. Add the wind wheel ester in at this point to add flavor. Don't rush to mix it all together. Let it sit for a moment. Let the floral fragrance emerge. I wonder what would be an equivalent wind flavor. Let's scatter the dandelion seeds in to make the drink look like it's been adorned with stars. Then place some ice cubes in, and then that's a wrap. Cool. You can't get the stuff mixed up. You want to make something delicious. Gotcha. Uh, sweet flour, milk, aster. Sweet, uh, well, sweet flour, alcohol, milk, aster, dandelion, ice. Ice came at the end. Mix the drink. Let's start blending. Uh, well, first, gotta put in the sweet, sweet flour. Undone. Oh, we put in the milk. Undone. Put the milk in. Then we put the wind wheel aster. Let it sit for a little bit. Dandelion seeds. And ice. Did I do it right? Special beverage. Who knows how it'll taste. Am I done? Yeah. What do you think? Swight, slight sweetness. Piercing forward taste. So it's piercing. Probably from the dandelions, maybe. Cooling. Like that of a flowing breeze. Honestly sounds like mint to me, but there is mint in this universe, so why wouldn't you just use mint? Maybe it's something... Similar to mints, like, uh, you know, my Fernet Branca could be very similar to that. That's kind of minty-ish, but with other botanicals in it. Next, I think this drink needs some taste testers. Let's go find some taste testers. Talk to Nimra, of course. Let's go. Hey, hey, buddy. Yeah, um, you're a drunkard, but everybody knows that. So try this new alcoholic drink. I'm sure you'll really enjoy it. Probably because you enjoy literally every other bit of alcohol. Oh, you want me to test it, do you? Alright. Oh, is it auto-playing? Oh, well. It doesn't have any taste of alcohol at all. I don't think a non-alcoholic drink really fits. Wait a minute, but, I've, but you added the base alcohol, I thought. Alright. You don't like it. I'm not going to go all the way up to the top. Talk to Adonis. Yeah. I'll just follow the path. Follow the path. Continuing up the stairs, continuing up the stairs. Let's see what Aramis says. <laughs> so many stairs in Mondstadt. Perhaps the Mont in Mondstadt is for mountain, as in the various levels of Mondstadt make it seem like a mountainous city. Perchance. Yo, Aramis. What do you think of this drink? I'm on duty. I can't drink. Oh, it's not alcoholic. Oh, well, I guess it's all right. I'm thirsty. Pretty refreshing. Perks you right up. New product from the cat's tail. Another taste later when they come by. It's pretty good. And now Nora. <laughs> Hi there, child. Would you like to taste this spirit? It's non-alcoholic, or so we're telling people. Kids shouldn't drink wine. It's not wine. Sweet and cool. I'll tell Timmy and Lily. You know Timmy? The kid who sits on the bridge. 
That's Timmy, all right. Hi there, everybody. Standing there all interestingly. Let's go talk back to Margaret. See what she has to say. That's pretty cool that they make a little drink in here. Honestly, it sounds to me like this would be really, really similar to, like, a grasshopper, except without the cocoa in it. Like, if you just did mint and milk together, it's, like, basically half of a grasshopper, which a grasshopper is basically chocolate mint cocktail. Very tasty. And if the, you use the correct color of ingredients, it's very green. Getting reasonably drunk during the festival, huh? No wonder the crowd at the Angel's share has grown. Huh. Still, I think this is fine other than those who'd like to, to get reasonably drunk. The children and the city guards should get to enjoy their own fair share of festive cheer as well. I'll continue tweaking this special blend. Thanks for your help, by the way. And here's a little something as thanks. Ah, yes. Happy Windbloom. Thank you, Margaret. What a peach. Alrighty. Pretty cool. What other event quests are there for moi? Did those, and I did those. Let's do quiet, please. This is a library. Quiet yourself. This is a library. <laughs> I say, I scream into the library like, Shut up! It's a library! Keep your voices down! And then everybody else in the library is just like, it's a library. Yeah. What a hypocrite. That reminds me, in high school, we the teachers, or not the teachers, I'm sorry, the media center specialists, because they did not want to be called librarians, um, set up this, like, stoplight thing in the library that responds to sound. So, like, if you were being too loud, it would get, like, it'd go red. If you were getting loud-ish, it would be yellow. And if it was all cool, it'd be green to, to let you know, like, hey, you're being too loud in the library. Open door. Hello. Hello, Ella Musk. It's probably not related to Elon. Yeah, Ika Gushimosi. Wonderful. You're speaking hillichural. My apologies. That's because the library has been so loud recently that I can't study hillichurlian in, in peace. Ever since the Windloom Festival started, there's been a great number of people hanging out here. Initially, they were keeping quiet and reading books, but then they started chatting. There's more. They did a lot of terrifying things. Turning book covers, sticking strange objects between the pages, they even went as far as to put books back on the shelves, upside down. A library is not a place for romantic rendezvous, unless one aims to disrupt all scholars actual studying inside as intended, that is. Maybe you should talk to Lisa, you know, the librarian. But I've heard that she's currently out on patrol with the acting Grand Master. If she were here, those couples would surely be on their best behavior. That's why I need to ask you for your assistance. Please tell them to get a hold of themselves. Okay. Hey, you kids, stop snogging behind the bookcase. Done. Thank you. Those three couples over there are making the most noise. If you can make them aware of how bothersome their babbling is, I will be able to continue my research. But be careful. They're quite difficult to handle. They're all over each other. Honestly, I can't even tell if it's two human beings or one human being connected at the face, hip, and legs. Hey, man, doing <laughs> magic trick. Uh, excuse me, did you want something? Shut up. Oh, my apologies, I'll be more mindful. I just can't help giving my voice to my feelings sometimes. While you weren't paying attention, I drew out a rose from between the pages. This book-born rose is just like you. Delicate, full of scholarly beauty. What? <gasps> that was amazing. And you're too noisy. Stop using books as props. Oh, yeah, Paimon, shut up. So now you understand. Some things are beyond our control. Once again, I'm truly sorry. I'll keep my volume in check. They're ignoring us. But we tried. Anyway, to the next ones. Hey there, y'all. 
seemingly rational man and seemingly rational woman. You claim that fluctuations of emotions may influence the accuracy of research and analysis. This assertion is founded on insufficient grounds. Oh, I understand. I must be encountering some strange hindrance to my research. You've come at the right moment. I'm having a little trouble right now, and I'd like to have your opinion on it as an outlander. If I want to prove the veracity of my logic, I must ensure that I keep my cool. But I can never do this, and especially not when I'm debating with her. I just can't seem to keep my cool and think. I find it strange too. Did you not sleep well last night, or are you hungover? Can y'all shut up? Sorry, but I won't rest until I figure this out. Therefore, I am ignoring you. He didn't listen. That's correct. Well, you shouldn't be deserving others that way. Also, stop putting the books back on the shelves with the spines facing inwards. Nobody cares. Paimon. It's a library. People will do what people will do. All right, what was the other one? Oh. Where's the other couple? Lower. Lower? Are they down here? Oh, they're over here. Ah! Stop running in the library! Young people in love. Such a thrilling story! It's a shame they didn't get to have their happy ending. We definitely won't become like them, right? That goes without saying. Even if we were torn apart and placed in different corners of the world, I'd find a way to bring you back to me. Y'all should shut up. Huh? I've been keeping my voice low all this time. It's like in that book. An obstacle in the way of our love. The volume of the library. Yeah, and maybe you should put books back where they belong. Like, look at them. They're in disarray. It's annoying. You're annoying. Fix it. Yeah, we got it. Could you leave us alone? We've interrupted us at a crucial moment. Crucial. No matter what hardships befall us, do you promise to stay the same as you are now and never change? I do. I swear on my life. I, a dynamic individual, will never change. That's excessive. I don't know. The very thought of losing you tears my heart in two. Aw. How your gentle nature makes me fall for you even more. How romantic. I'm talking to a brick wall. Nobody's in the mood for advice, but they're clearly in the mood for something. None of them are very good library etiquette. We should go talk to Wyrat. Fine. Oh, I gotta go upstairs, don't I? Oh, Breeze emits the thing. Now it's in my archive. Oh, I can't climb up the walls. I thought surely I could climb up the walls. More books? There's always more books to find. And probably I'll read them one day. Or not. Oh, Wyrit. What is this? Library rules? Nah, nobody cares. Hey, Wyrit. Help me, I help. There's a racket. <laughs> we'll have to use that method. That method? Yes, that method. Bring me a plunger, a stapler, and a whole lot of mayonnaise. Miss Lisa mentioned in the past that there would be consequences for breaking the library rules. Do you mind going to the library to pass Miss Lisa's message along? Making dog ears on pages, stuffing roses into books, putting them onto shelves the wrong way. These are definitely violations of the library rules, which I walked past and did not pay attention to. Let's go pass on the message. Carry with you Lisa's message. Oh, what? Lisa's coming back so soon. No, she'll be angry. She'll find out people are making a mess of the books and dog-earing the pages. Shame. What are we to do? What are we to do indeed? Oh, maybe we should clean up and get these ugly couples out of here. That was ingenious. How did you do it? The guy upstairs. He did it. Lisa would probably would have been pretty pissed if she saw the library like this. It would have been terrible. Alright, that quest is done. And uh, what about the other one? There seems to be one more quest that I am able to do right now. So let's go to it. Flavor of the month. The flavor of the month is disappointment. 
Uh-oh. What does disappointment taste like? The wind. Time to talk to Brooke. Brooke, where are you? Are you outside of the city? Brooke. Uh, perhaps you're at the winery. You're most definitely at the winery. Most definitely at the winery. So let's check it out. Ah, uh, yes. There is the winery. Oh, sweet, a chest. My chest. My chest. Give me my chest. Alright, let's wait for the stamina, and then boop! To the winery! Honestly, that was not a bad jump. That worked perfectly. Yes! A perfect jump! I've never seen it before in my life. Except a million other times. In the same game. Actually, I see this quite often. Oh, uh, I can open that thing up. Because I have the key. I have the blue key, but I don't have the yellow key. Electro crystal. A shrine of the depths key. Will I use it? Yes, I will. Because I have four, apparently. Luxurious chest. Wow, look at all this stuff. Guide to Ballad. Get this mushroom. I believe... I think it was... Albedo may be the one who uses Filomeno mushrooms for their ascension. But I don't have Albedo yet. Why isn't he here yet? Can I help you, miss? You were... I remember you. You were Jiangling's assistant, weren't you? The memories of our culinary duel are still fresh in my mind. I may have lost to her last time, but this time I'll create a dish that has the taste of the wind. Then I'll take it and ask her for a rematch. You mean windwheel asters and dandelions? I specially commissioned an adventurer to help me go to Dragonspine and obtain some chilled meat for this dish. However, that adventurer, Schuster was his name, I think is yet to return. I've heard that Dragonspine is a very dangerous place. I wonder if we might have run into some trouble. Could you help me search for him? Fine. Thanks for your willingness to help. Make sure to light some fires to keep warm. Dragonspine is very cold after all. Do you just need chilled meat or do I need to find Schuster? I need to find Schuster. Alrighty then. We're going back to Dragonspine. Guess I'm going back. Cool. The game has given me a reason to head back to Dragonspine. I love Dragonspine. Come on. Silly dandelion. Get some of these pine cones. More pine cones. And proceed on. Perhaps I'll find the door in my quest to find the Schuster. Schuster? Shuster? Ah, whatever. Pinecone! And another pine cone. And another pine Oh, that's a mushroom. <gasps> Whopper flower. Hey there. Get overloaded and fly. Oh my god. Where'd you go? Hey there. Take this. Nice and spicy. Get overloaded, my friend. The end is nigh. Kill you, collect your nectar. I require more nectar. I got two of them, sweet. No, oh, wait, 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 wait. No, don't get distracted by the slimes. Go to Dragon Spot. I must not let my guard down. I must not get distracted.
Let's see. Ah, dear, don't fall. Oh, please do not fall off the waterfall. I don't like it. Uh, am I gonna make that? I don't know if I will. Mm, maybe. With perseverance, anything's possible. Boop, there we go. I just noticed this water up here is insanely blue. Perhaps that's because of the power of Animo. Alright, so where is... <laughs> Gets the dragon spine. Has no idea where Schuster is. Little Whopper flower. Uh, there's a chest down there. What are you? Hey there. Oh, it's... You're, you an asshole. Overloaded. What will you do? You're invisible. I can... Yep, I can still see you, though. Yeah, that's... You're not helping your case here, pal. As a dutiful maid would. No escape. Oh, come on. It's not bad. Don't hit me like that. Don't cancel my attack. I'll catch up. Take that. Into the water. Vaporize. Oh, hi there. You're back. Okay, okay. You continue to say that, Xiangling, as if you're actually going to eat another human being. Will you? I mean, perhaps that's just the Li Wei way. And if it is, then, I mean... Who am I to stop you? Plug in my headphones. I connect myself back to the Matrix. So that my headphones don't completely run out of batteries. Here we go. Back into it. And now, back to Dragonspine. I didn't think I was going to return, but I'm back again, baby. You get that, you get that. Yeah. What's there? Investigat? what I get? Money! Wonderful. I like money. Money is good. Money very good. Oh, hey there, guys. Fire, 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 fire. Everybody's all fireful. All right, that was easy. Pretty easy, pretty easy. Alrighty, uh, I'm freezing. Oh, quick! Light this on fire. Yes. Is there a chest over here that I've yet to get? Ah, yes, there is. Cool. I'm gonna kick the shit out of you guys. Another test subject. I'm gonna test you. I'm gonna test you real good. I wonder what you taste like. Hey, come on now. Don't be doing that. Swirl attack. Stop that. Enough of that. Don't smack me like that. Don't smack me like that. Smack me like this. And I'll catch up. Yeah. Not too bad at all. And then kill you. Oh, I needed that. And uh you're still alive. Where did you come from? Give me your drops. If I keep stabbing you with the spear, perhaps you'll get the point. T. All right, there wasn't any crimson agate in there, but alas, it was still a chest of dragon spine, and I'm happy to retrieve those when I can. There seems to be a pathway up the mountain this way. Is there, or am I just crazy? I don't believe there is. 
But I'm gonna go up that way anyway. I'm a mountaineering adventurer! And I search for the door. Oh, there's something... Ah, this could be convenient. Where's the closest agate? Where are the edges? No. I wonder what could be laying inside of that marble ice. There's some trees up there, so perhaps... Perhaps there'll be some crimson agate up here. Agate? Agate? Oh, there's something over here. Who will it be? Whopper flowers! As a dutiful maid would. To ashes! Oh, stop, please. T -t -t Use the ice ability. You know what? Just swirl it. Why won't you get sucked in? Why won't you suck like that? I specifically requested to suck. And I can get whack the boat again. Oh, and you're running away. Not appreciated. Not cool, dude. Not cool. Or rather, very cool. Get some warmth during battle. You know, those, those warming nectar bottles are actually insanely convenient for times like now. Where, like, I'm in a battle and I really just don't want to go and find some place to warm up. Alright, that didn't work. Hey, but that helped. Oh, did that not... Oh, okay. That didn't work entirely well enough. And now I'm freezing. Still reloaded. Oh, yes. Uh, fire, 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 fire. Something that warms me up? Please. Anything to warm me up? Nope. Let's switch to Beto. Something down here. There's also a chest down here. And things that can fire up. Cool. Yes, thank you. I require the warmth. All right, now to continue my mission up here. Come back. Oh, you're coming up. I'm coming up, so you better get this party started. Oh, don't. Oh, don't fall off the edge. I want your drops. More whopper flower. Oh, and this guy's up here, too. Dude, what are you doing? If I just, like, if I just send you off the edge. Fire powers, activate. Oh, please. Zhongling. Zhongling, what are you doing? Zhongling, stop. Zhongling, no! No, Zhongling, no! Break your shield. Swirl? Swirl attack? I just take care of you. And then the big old guy. Okay. Got that nectar. And then go back down here. To continue. Oh, I must warm up. I must warm myself. Alright. I have been warm. I can grab chest now. Oh, what? You're back? Oh. It's uh, one of the, the... The caster churl things. Law churl, maybe? But now I will attack you properly. And I'll even bring the fight to you. Or you'll bring the fight to me. That's fine too, I guess. Not necessary. I'll take care of you. And you. There we go. Collect my drops. I wish I knew what she was saying. The power that ended something. Paichan, it sounds like. As a good night should. Boop. There we go. Chest unlocked. Another chest at my disposal. 
But I still have to find wherever the the nearest scarlet something or other. Crimson agate and scarlet something else. I, I can never seem to remember. I'm starting to remember, though. I'm getting better. I need to find... I need to find one somewhere. I know there was one below, so maybe I grab it and run up the mountain? Or maybe there's one elsewhere. Like, I don't see any around here. But I know there was one down below. Let's take a look. Or the way the bird fly. Ah, there was one right there. Just needed a different perspective. Watcha! Okay, that's Scarlet Quartz, and come over, and let's see. It's probably just a chest in there, but it could be something important. I yeah, just chest. Alright, let's continue to find Schuster! Schuster, I'm coming for you. But interesting. Okay, so this must be an area of the mountain that I've not yet been to. Maybe there's some secret over here that's good. Or perhaps I have been here before, and actu in actuality, I just decided to ignore this chest, or just didn't notice it the first time. Anything over this edge? I don't see anything. I don't see anything new. I recognize that area over there. You recognize this area down here? Yeah, I do. I will find you, Schuster. My boy, Schuster. Not that way, but perhaps if I proceed up this way. Was oh, this a icy thing? Nope, just a rock. Ha! I thought. Snow-covered path. Feels familiar. Some star silver over there. A challenge. That's one of the challenges that I've yet to complete. I'll give it another shot. He's like giving things a shot. Here's a scarlet thing. That could be convenient at some point, maybe. Let's get these guys. Let's grab some of these guys. More materials. Someone needs assistance. And I see... Is there something important up there? It's a bird. Bird's not super important. Take this crimson agate. Scarlet Quartz! Scarlet Quartz, I see now. Maybe this is the Scarlet Quartz that's going to help me grab this one. Run, 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 run! I did it! And it was just a chest. But even still, I did it finally. That took me long enough to find one that actually worked. Leave it to me. I will take care of this little asshole. Oh, come on. You just did your thing again. Swirl, I say. Oh, you're killing me. What will I do? Die? That's the only option, really. No, please. Please, no. Nope, don't do it. Melting away. I'm not sure what that's for, but I will figure it out later. I must find Schuster! That marbling's not going to bother me anymore, finally. Yes. That marble ice. That bothered me for so long. Oh, I forgot to give the challenge another shot. I'll be back eventually. I always come back to Dragon's Spine. I always do. I really like this area. It's cool. I just like how it seems to have, like, a self-contained story that exists 
like alongside everything else that's going on like i don't know if there's any like world quests that happen here like there are no quests it's just you do things and if there are quests i, I haven't found them yet but it's cool that this one's like totally like your choice you want to you want to come here and do whatever this place has to offer then you can do that it's cool uh yeah i've definitely been here before schuster's along that way but if i move forward a little bit we'll see yeah this is the same thing over here i'll be at a better vantage point up here what's under here a creature or a slime that's cool too Superconducts. I must leave no stone unturned. Electrification. Swirl. Swirl. Time to clean up. Poof. And the slime is gone. Spike up. Up, up, up I go. Hey, everybody. I gotta get warm, so... Let me do that. And then there's this guy over here. I have fought them plenty of times before. Like this one right here. I have, but I've fought this one plenty of times. And I don't want to touch it. I'm about to get cold, so I'm gonna head towards this campfire instead. Oh, I have seems to have run out of stamina. Hey, pal. Well met. Well met. All right, anyway. Well, if you say so. You're big and bulky. I love your fists, dude. The aesthetic is just... It's good. All right, then I'll just come around the other side and nice do like that. Fight. Stumble. Get swirled. That's the way the swirl crumbles, my friend. Nope, that's that's it. That's it. We're done. Oh, Schuster. Where are you, my friend? Schuster. Schuster, my friend, come back to me. Uh, already been there. Been there, done that. Uh, higher up, I guess. Long to a coast of another mountain. Another spire. Up to the top of this peak. Anything at the top of this peak? Nah. Schuster's no here. Is Schuster over here? Let's see. Oh, it's Schuster? Nah. This is foreboding. Whoa, that's pretty cool. What about this area here? I've been here before? Oh, I mean, I believe I have been here before, but it seems that there's more stuff to find. I guess I can just continually investigate these areas to get more stuff. Hmm, that's cool, I guess. Yeah, I, I've definitely been here a bunch of times before. But the spookiness up there? Yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, Shangling? Uh, can we... Perhaps not? Can we keep it chill for a little bit? Something icy up there. Icy and dicey. <sighs> yes, continue climbing. Please don't get stuck. That'd be unfortunate. Let's go over there to that ledge. And then regain the stamina. Oh dear. Probably shouldn't have done that. Huh. 
Oh, no. Oh, dear. Okay. That sucks. All right. Well, I'll try that climbing again. But perhaps at a better angle this time. Oh, look, it's getting cold again. Now I'm here. I can go over here. I can use one of these things. Make me feel warm. Duh, I've got a beautiful aura surrounding myself. Now it's gone. And I get cold again. It's only temporary, but it works. Alright, over here. No, stop. Shangling, don't jump off of the mountain. Jump onto it. Tonto, jump on it. Kimosabe, jump on it. Alrighty then. Anything newsworthy up here? It doesn't really look like it. Oh, um... Nah. This isn't Marble Ice. It's just mint. Something over here. Star Glow Cavern. Beautiful. I already did all these runes, apparently. Nice. Runes are good. Um, I definitely fought a boss here, too. But it's gone. Oh, what is... Did I already light this tablet up? Yeah, this one's already lit up. But it best to double check. I never know if I missed it or not. I never know. Oh, don't fall. No, no, let's not do that. All right, well, I have to find Schuster. So I will continue making my way... Oh, across the mountain. All right. And that's what I'll do. I will make my way to the other side. Through the caverns. And icicles come down from above to remind me just how small and feeble I am. Oh my god, it's the door! Yes! I found the door! This is the door! I have to mark this on my map. I found the door. Holy cow! I found the door. And it's right next to a teleport waypoint. Who knew? Uh. Nice. Now, can I enter the door? Use the above items to open the door. Do I need all of them? Okay, I need all of them. Good to know. So when I find the third one, now at least I know where I can go. <sighs> nice. Finally found the door again. Uh, complete the time trial challenge? Yeah, sure, I can do that. I hope it'll help me find what's-his-face. Blow up the exploding barrels. In 30 seconds. Oh, come on, that didn't work. No, don't help. Oh, oh, please, the mountain. Oh, please, the mountain. Okay, explosion, and then that one. Boop. Explosion! Kind of wish complete. And continuing down to not only find Schuster, but also complete these Crimson Wishes. Do I want to play Soul Worker later? Sure, dear. Yeah, let's do that. That sounds like fun. I like that idea. Or orange juice? I'll let you decide. What would you like to do? Oh, time to go down to the ground. You know, either? Oh, well, that's cool. We haven't done orange juice in a while. How about we do some orange juice? Oh, come on. Don't. Just, just die. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Excuse me. 
There's a Crimson Wish over here, so let's get to it. Icy Harvest. Defeat all opponents. Alright. There's a lot of ice down here. Oh, they're probably inside of the ice. Oh, you work on the... Okay, cool. Yeah, let me know. Let me know. And uh, we'll just... I guess I'll play it after this. We'll transfer. Whoops. You're toast. Actually, let's melt the ice with this. There we go. Now that I got this. I see. I see. Do, do, do. Defeat all of the opponents. Can do. Cool. Crimson Wish complete in three out of five. There's another one down here. I'm getting cold again. There's nothing over here that's warm, though, is there? No, there's not. I must proceed down below. Let's see. Is there something warm down here? There's a warming thing. Right down here. Get warm. And then I shall move to over here. To I guess I have to kill them all. I see harvest again. Melt! Die! Oh, come on. I was about to smack you on the face. Now we're both dead. Nah, just kidding. Only you. Where's that other Crimson Wish? The other one is... Oh, it's way down there. Oh, sister. Are you Schuster? Terrified Schuster. <laughs> gold. Why? Why is it so gold? Can, can someone, can someone help me make a fire? I suppose. Light the fire. But first, stones. Many, many stones. Alright. Go over and do your thing. Yes. Talk to me, Schuster. Ah, I've been revived. Th you lit the fire. Th th thank you, good-hearted good traveler. Thank you. Dude, you okay? A little warmer, that's for sure. I'll be fine. I, I was originally commissioned to come here to obtain some chilled meat. I started out trying to look for some on the outskirts of Dragonspine, but as I walked, I misplaced my tinder, and that was before I got lost by mistake. If you hadn't arrived, I don't know what I would have done. You have my thanks. So, what are you going to do about it? The commission? Brooke sent you to find me, huh? Well, she must be beside herself right now, I imagine, but as it stands, I haven't the energy to travel all the way to give, give her this meat. I'm sorry to ask you, but can you give the meat to her? Sure, dude. Thanks, man. Thanks, dude. High quality chilled meats. As opposed to this shitty stuff. I probably get an achievement somewhere around here. What'd I get? Defeat a cryo assistant mage while all her cryo assistants are currently active. I could have sworn I've done that before. But alas. Back to Mondstadt. It'll warp back to Mondstadt. Actually. Crimson Wish. Let's go south. Let's complete that first. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. It's very windy over here. I wonder why. Oh no. Just keep heading south. I should be a-okay. I'm glad to know I finally found that door. 
And also good to know as well that I still need that other key in order to open it all. I need all three lock boxes in order to unlock the locked door. That's okay. Oh, more chilled meat? Hey, do man if I do. I love how these uh, these animals, after being frozen for God even knows how long, the first thing they do is I gotta run. I, I have to go. I have to run right now. That's the first thought. The first thought is I gotta run and I gotta run now. All right then. Now let's find this other crimson wish. There's a bunch of scarlet quartz down here. And still, there's this big skull thing. And burbs. Boba, get them. No, uh, Boba. No, no. Yes, thank you. Ah. Oh, stop that. What are you doing? Oh, I don't know. What are you doing? What, who is it? Oh, it's a Whopper flower? I could probably use hitting one of those. <laughs> don't fall into the water without stamina. I will die. Alright, there's the thing over there. Let's make my way across this little thing here. Complete that Crimson Wish and see what happens. I don't know. And then I'll head on back to that tree thing and see what there is to do. Collect them all. Gotcha. 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 Oh, uh, got it. Is this really it? Is that really it? Alright. Hey, Crimson Wish complete. Uh, what do I do now? With this not with this newfound goodness of mine, what do I do? I guess I'll... North is up that way anyway, so I think what I'll do is I will... Can I just warp to this thing? Yeah, I'll do that. I'll do some warpage. Warpage because it seems that I'll be playing something else later a little bit. When the fiancé says, let's play a game, which doesn't happen very often, I am... The first, the first thing my thought is, is yes, let's do that. I love playing games. Alright, so if I talk to this tree... Crimson Wish refreshes in one day. So what does that mean now? Oh, I see. Complete to obtain Crimson Agate. Ah, I see. So you complete those, which allows me to increase this tree level. I see. All right. That makes sense. Cool. Let's grab some rewards. How many more do I need? Not too bad. 30 more. I believe. Looks like I just need 30 more to get that tree up to max level. Not too bad. Awesome. Very cool. And let's TP to Mondstadt so that I can get this Windbloom missile. Oh, uh, Springvale, actually. Not to Mondstadt. Oh. Love Dragon Spine. And I made some progress. I found my door. Don't know where that other box is, but I'll find it eventually. I bet that other stone that I need to do, that I need to click, and the other lockbox, I'm guessing is up on the mountain. Like the tip of the mountain. Because I haven't explored that completely. But I will eventually. Talk to me, Brooke. Oh, you're back. With the meat, yes. That's great. What about Schuster? Whatever. Good, nothing serious happened. Once I've finished this dish, I should bring him a serving too. Speaking of that, this chilled meat, it really is different from normal meat. Perhaps a dish made from it will really have that certain boom shakalaka, a certain je ne sais quoi, a type of yo wow jabam. Still, I think the dandelion seeds would be needed to make something that bears the taste of the wind. But if, only, if we only do that, I feel like the result would be much different from any normal meat-based cuisine. We need some sort of decisive condiment. How about... I've actually met Zhongling a few more times since our contest, and I heard about a dish known as mushroom slime stew from her. I never used such a strange and curious ingredients before, but however, amazing dishes require equally unique ingredients. Traveler, if I might trouble you, will you get slime duck condensate and dandelion seeds? Sure, I hope it doesn't have to be special. Can I just give you the stuff I have? Oh, thank god. Yes, I do have it already! 
There's your dandelion seeds. And slime bombs. Oh, how about now? Can I click the confirm button, please? I want to reconnect to the server. Yeah, I guess my internet got weird for a moment. Huh. Weird. Hi there, Brooke. Trying to talk to you again. Dandelion seeds? Yes, there you go. And there you go. Give! There you go. I don't know what happened there. Internet goes dead every once in a while. Very odd. Weird, could we just upgraded. All right, well, I did that, and I, it's, that's all the event quests that I can do for now. Right? Festive anecdotes. That's all of them. That was pretty weird. Am I back now? It says reconnected. Oh, looks like I'm back now. That was pretty weird. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Hello there, Pepe. What are you up to, sir? Running practice. I'm practicing the art of running. Cool. Good for you, buddy. All right. Perchance, I'm gonna go to the top of Dragon Spine now that I'm on that topic. And uh, yeah, go to the top of Dragon Spine and see if I can't find that last tablet in the meantime. Teleport. Teleportation. Or oh, I wonder if this counts as the same stream or not. I hope not. Or I hope so. Hmm. Oddities. Anyway, now I'm at the top here. I feel that there is probably, hopefully, another tablet here that I have yet to find. There was one tablet at the bottom. I believe there was one down here, right? Yes, there was one down there, and I need one more. Actually, can I do this yet? You, uh, uh, no. Adventure rank 30, which is two adventure ranks from now. Let's warm this up. Oh, Guova, stop. To the fire, please. To the fire, please. Oh, this one's lit. That's fine. Now I'm all nice and warm and on fire. Now, I feel that there is... Another tablet in here somewhere that I might have just missed the first time. Let's go back to the bottom down here and see if I can't find it. I've just, I've got that feeling. Got that feeling that I missed something. Okay, so this is where I started. Down here. I was not able to go up here before. But now I can. And I think the next place that I should check is actually that Crimson Heart area. Because I... Yeah, it was pretty cool. Uh, I need my stamina so I can go. And... Oh, jeez. <laughs> Alrighty then. Yeah. yeah, and the same thing will happen over here. Yep. No, stop. Don't drown. Just, just, just... Do that thing we call a swim. There's that. Ah. Alright. That worked. No tablets over here. Crimson agate. Gar Scarlet quartz. No tablet in this wall over here. I do not see a tablet down there in the water. Animo. Go with this big old piece of blue crystal here. And no tablet over here. Noticing a distinct lack of tablet. Potentially because there is no tablet over here. But I double checked nonetheless. Because I got a feeling. I want to say my tablet senses are tingling, but they've been wrong every single time. So, no. The senses are not tingling at all. Nothing's tingling, actually. 
Let's see a tablet over there. And then I came to here. Perchance I find a tablet. Not down there, because there already is one. Could very well be on top of one of those pillars. My intuition tells me that if there were one, it's on the path here somewhere in plain sight that I should have seen the first time around. But might have missed. Somewhere up here, perhaps. This little ledge. All right. Not here, it seems. There are some areas over there. Ah, that's pretty high. I didn't actually check out this area. There were some big monsters over here. Or not big monsters, but big mechanical ice shooty beam things. I do not know what they're called, as I did not pay attention to their name tag. Nice and warm. I have yet to see a tablet. Perhaps the tablet would be up at the very, very top. That's what I would think. Like at the very tippy top. But there was no tablet up there. Not at all. Still see no tablets. Nothing of importance. At least nothing I can tell that is of importance. Some things to investigate over here. No tablets that look clickable. I could pass over there, but let's see what's up over here. This door was already unlocked. Something in here. Any tablet? Nope, no tablet. No tablet. I will proceed in this general direction. It's looking a little chilly over there. Start. Get warm. Go, get warm. Any tablet up here? This would seem like a fine place for a tablet. Oh, there's something over here. Oh. I don't wonder what's in there. Perhaps, perhaps. Perhaps it's been hidden from my plain sight. Or it's just a chest. In which case, it's fine. Chest. Good things, good things indeed. But there is no tablet. There is no tablet. Not around here, at least. Not on top of those pillars. Ah, uh, yes. Continuing upward. back at Dragon Spine again, so I shall update my info accordingly. Dragon Spine. Dragon Spine. Dragon Spine. It's a word that has dragon in it. Go up this direction. It'd be interesting to see if the tablet is actually on one of those floating rock islands. Maybe. Maybe. Keep that over here. There's an animo thing there. I see a bunch of flames. I don't see anything on top of them. Not from this distance. What 
What do I see from this angle? Anything? Not really. Everybody die. Everybody gonna die. Boop. Gotcha. On fire. Bye, bye gents. So long and farewell, Alfita Zane. Adieu. <laughs> Off the edge you go. I see no tablet over here. Oops, I see nothing of importance below me now that I'm from a different vantage point. Now that I observe from a different vantage point. Nothing on top of those things. Not from what I can tell. Let's see. Bit of a climate thing going on here. Nice. Could be a tablet along the way. Maybe. Perhaps if I just say tablet enough, one will just show up. Tablet, 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 tablet. Tablet, 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 tablet. Nope. A little area down here. Anything? Tablety? Hmm, it doesn't appear to be. Tablet, tablet, tablet. Oh, stop. Yo, don't fall. That'd be unfortunate. Another thing over there. Anything below me? Nope. Skyfrost nail. Yes! Fire on the flames. I continue to the top, I suppose. Alrighty. Up here, any tablets yet? Down this little ledge, perhaps? I see not a tablet. Nor anything else, for that matter. Oh yeah, it seemed the stream did start anew. Hmm. I'm gonna have to combine those videos later. Weird. The VOD's gonna have to... Aw, oh, man, that means I gotta... I gotta process it, in, process it in two pieces again. Ugh. I had to do that one time before, too, and it was just annoying. The only thing I have for putting videos together on my computer is, like, some Windows app that I found. And, like, it just wasn't having it. Oh, look. A diggy place. What's over here? Dig? Can I dig? Can I Can I dig? This looks like a diggy kind of place. Boba, get them. Is this a sign for digging? Usually this is a sign for digging. Huh. I guess I can't dig here. Thought surely I'd be able to. Usually this sign pops up in a digging area, a diggable area. Hmm. Odd. Alright. I got excited for a moment because I thought, oh boy, a digging area, that might, must mean maybe the other key is below it. But, uh, no, nah, I guess not. That or things are glitching out, which they shouldn't be. I hope not. certainly nice to think about things not glitching. There's nothing over here, nothing over there. Maybe I gotta go to the top again. Because this will take me to the top of the nail. Or closer to the top. Was there a tablet up here that I wasn't aware of? <laughs> Maybe.
to the top of the nail. Here we go now. I don't think there was anything else up here that I needed. Oh, stop. Please. <laughs> there we go. Don't fall. Not from this height. That'd be unfortunate. Nope. No tablet. But somewhere up here, you could see, like, something in the sky, or... Yeah, there it is. There's that thing in the sky. Or maybe it's right above. Oh, I'm unsure. Well, now, from this vantage point, what do I... What do I see that's new? Nothing, really. Hmm. Perhaps I came up here for naught. Unfortunate. There's a little ledge over there. Some torches. Nothing else of importance. It doesn't look like there's anything on top of those, like, things. The floating rocks, I mean. It really seems like this is a diggable area, though. Otherwise, why would the sign be here? Alas, I was convinced. And convinced incorrectly. Alright, well, down the mountain I go then. Was not f able to find anything of interest. Something's glowing down here. Oh, that's just how it was. What I will try to do is I'm going to go back to that Crimson Heart area and see if I find anything different. If I can remember which waypoint that's at. Wasn't that one? Not that one. Was it down here? I think it was down here. I shall see. I shall see. Was it? Was it not? I know it was in an area that looked pinkish because of the discoloration. I don't think this is the one. Or is it? Maybe if I run up a little farther? Yeah, hi there. I'm ignoring you. Stop that. Was it that way? I don't believe it was. Perhaps part of the map has a pinkish tint to it. Anything look pink? Oh, there's pretty pink. Seems pretty pink over there. Perhaps it's over there. I believe so. And back towards the pink. Perhaps there's something new there. Now that I went to the top. And came back down again. Oh, I see a chest over there too. I'll investigate the pink. Then I'll check out that chest which I have yet to grab. And, uh, yeah. I oh, I died. Whoops. Anything different now? I'm pretty sure I have to complete that dungeon first before I can do anything about this. Strange glow. Strange glow indeed. Alright. Nothing else with that. i do that chest and, uh, that's probably where I'll end Genshin Impact for now. After I get that chest. But uh, I'll apparently be back later. Because Anna and I will be playing some 100% orange juice. Where's that chest at? Hey. Ooh, excuse me. There you are. Oh, not these guys. I don't want you all. Let's just get this done. Get it done. If I just keep on smacking you. 
You yeah, just don't. I don't want to. I don't want you to. Ah, oh, you put your shield up. Ass. Cannot believe you. You're so annoying. You were so annoying. You got a bunch of your health back. Oh, it's because of this one. It's most dead. Oh, I should have taken out the blue guy. Goodness gracious. I cannot believe. No, stop. Stop that. He's like fully healed now. Damn. Oh, and I thought I was doing so well. Shucks. I like to go with this BS again. Oh, I almost, I almost took care of it quite nicely. It could have been so smooth. Leave it all to me. Here you stop. Fire power. Overloaded! Firepower! Firepower again! Firepower additional times. Thunderhammer guy. Like Thor and his Thunderhammer? Mjolnir? Except now it's purple. And it's in a completely different universe. Yes, how's the fire feel? Huh? How's that feel? How's that feel, buddy? A little overloaded with emotions, perhaps? I'm sure it doesn't feel very good. And it shouldn't. You're a bad man. You're a bad man. You hurt people. So you will die. The vigilante justice! There we go. It's insignia. It's insignia. Light that up. Whatever's in this chest. Alrighty then. And what I'll do is I'll take myself back to Mondstadt so I have a nice place to start for next time. And I think that'll be it. For Genshin Impact, that is. Back to map. What is going on today? Comcast, what's your problem, dude? What's your problem, Comcast? I'd love to blame myself for using too much internet, but, like, I'm the only one here. Alright, well, now I'm here, and that's pretty much where I'm going to get and Genshin Impact for now. It's been fun, it's been a joy, and I very much enjoyed myself this fine, wonderful morning into afternoon. It's about 3 o'clock over here now. And, uh, later on, I'll be back with some... 100% orange juice with my fiance who wants to play a game, which makes me very happy. In the meantime, uh, I should be back rather soon, so uh, stick around if you want to. If not, peace out until then. Bye, everybody.